Okay, who all did I miss in the chat out there? I see. I know. I get. I know. I get my lives. My computer's running way slow right now. I don't know why. Um, Was it like that today? All right. Oh, hey. Hey, how's it going, everybody? <laughs> hey, everybody. How's it going? John here. What if I good scrolls off orchard design and woodworks? I was in my shop all day cleaning over on that side of the shop. I got like 25% of the shop done. I put a reel up. I put some posts up on Facebook, everything else. 25%, I'd say. Uh, yeah. So that's like a full day. And then I was working on a, a design, a pattern, and everything else. So, hey, everybody. How's it going? Uh, welcome to a new show. Uh, we got. Uh, um, a new project to work on, believe it or not. Uh, so let's go with the uh, hey Herb Adele uh, Art Art Herb Adele Art Herb Adele Joe Hey Joe uh, Tracy uh, Joe Tracy Steve C uh, Tracy Joe Herb Steve C Art McConney uh, Joe Adele Joe Adele Larry Hey Larry uh, blah, blah 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 Steve Steve John Joe. Steve, John, John, uh, Annie, uh, blah, 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 JJ, Liz, blah, 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 blah. on the main stage, Kanda. There we go. Hey, everybody, how's it going? <laughs> and Steve. And uh, uh, on the panel with us, we got uh, we got Art. Hey, Art, how's it going? Hey, hello, everybody. Hello, Adele, Tracy, Herb. Oh my gosh, Joe, Steve. Art with Connie, uh, Henry, or Larry. Uh, did I get them all? <laughs> and anyone I missed before I get done, uh, I think you said Annie, JJE, Liz. Wow, a lot of people here. Yeah, it's a huge crowd. And, and Steve. Okay, I think I got them all. We're just going to do the normal puzzles. And, do the uh, normal. and since there's a lot of people here, because I know somebody will probably ask, I did very well today, $350 in six hours. Cool, that's pretty good. Yeah, that was excellent. And it only cost me $5 to go, so I really made a good profit today. That's a hell of a deal. Yeah. Yeah, it was, it, it was windy, but it was it was a good day. It's like a hundred bucks an hour. <laughs> pretty much. That's some pretty good wages, man. All right, I just got to print off a copy of what I'm doing here so I can show you guys. I still got to go over and uh, get my wood. Well, my, my wood's cut down the side. I just got to prep it with uh, my pattern on. If I can go, I, mm, yeah, I'll do that over there. And then I'll come back over here. So I'm actually doing this for... And crafty Annie for her son because uh, I I was showing a, a broken project I had on the side over there. She's like, "Well, let me see that. I want to see that. I want to see that." I show it to her. She goes, oh, "I want one." I said, "Well, this isn't this isn't a complete finished project though, so uh, I got to do a background for it and then a main picture for the front of it." So uh, this is what it's going to look like ish, right? So there's the background, super over background, right? I can see that yeah, super grover background, and then grover super grover is going to go over top of it, and I'm going to color. I'm going to I'm going to use uh, stains or writ, writ dye. So I'm going to do two two cuts of this, one for the backer and one for the front. So it, and then I'll I'll dye it blue, yellow, and red for the G, and then super grover will be like I'll, I'll dye his cape, and then he'll be dyed blue, and then yellow and red and gray for his hat. This helmet, which will be, and th this will be on top of this. So there we go. Question. Super yes. Did you get, was you able to get your crayons today? No, I never did get my crayons. I didn't, even, I didn't leave the yard. Okay. I'm just but checking because I'm here today. Because I'll go out, I'll go out tomorrow morning and uh, uh, when they open and see if they got any if not i'll go down to i'll go i'll just pick up a bunch of boxes that have teal and whites in them and by the time i got home you would you was 
probably just well, about done, you know, maybe a half hour, 40 minutes. And by the time I ate and all that, you, you was already off. So it no biggie. Yeah, yeah. Maybe, oh, so yeah. Aunt. So Annie, after after have it cut out and, and I get the background dyed, let me okay. know because I, I might just leave Grover wood, but just let, like when it's done, just let me know. Hey Debbie, how's it going? Over on Facebook. The Facebooks. Hey Lisa. Hello, Lisa. Lisa's only gonna be here for a bit, like she always is. <laughs> She's got her own show to do. Don't forget to hydrate. You drink coffee? No. See this? I'm getting this from I'm getting this from my freaking from my crocheters now. Coke. Don't, don't forget to hydrate. Coke. They don't make coffee. Hey, Mike. Uh, yeah, they do. Not in my house. Hello, Andy, Mike. Uh, Coca Cola, me coffee. Coca Cola with coffee. Yuck! You don't ruin Coke like that. <laughs> it's uh, Coca Cola with coffee made with rich Brazilian coffee. Images. What the hell does it look like? Yeah, there you go, right there. Oh, vanilla, vanilla, and dark blend. That's just that's saying. Just, that's just coke just abuse. Saying. That's just coke oh, abuse. Oh. They got uh, oh caramel. Well, see, they got they, they, they got a caramel one out now too. So caramel, vanilla, and dark blend. Coca Cola with coffee. I'm just saying. There you go. That's it looks nasty, nasty. looks just like coke. Just saying. I'd, I'd rather lick up the sawdust on the floor. That's a waste of good coke. Yes, I agree with you, Lisa. I would just throw rum in it instead. <laughs> nah, I just skip the coffee. Need, ru need, need rum in that coke. Ah, don't, don't don't put ice in it. It'll just water it down. Don't need no watered down uh, rum in my my coke. Hey, Jess. Oh my God. <laughs> Sorry, let me catch up with the chat. Who's all, who who joined us? Mike Mike's out there. Hot damn, uh, Elaine. Yeah, Elaine. <laughs> Steve says he's hydrating. Steve, wait. Oh, I'll be cutting a couple of blades. I'll guarantee you that. Uh, Crystal. Do, do, do. Who else? Did I, did I miss anybody else? Larry. Yeah. Yeah. Jess. Yeah. And that's it so far. Uh, oh, update from Connie. Um. I want to let you know, Ron is okay. He's still not back to normal. He appeared to have pushed himself too far, and he didn't drink enough water. We hydrate. Come on, come on, Connie. You know the rules. When we say hydrate, you got to hydrate, right, Chris? Otherwise, you'll end up over at Chris's place. Oh, no hey, Chris, how's it going? No room at the no end. room at the end. Nope. <laughs> There's a manger out back. See ya. <laughs> Stay healthy. <laughs> hydrate. Wow. That's great news, Connie. Yeah, just keep an eye on him. You know, they're taking my cousin's kid off of life support tonight. That'll be a fun one. Uh, good or good or bad? Bad. Hit a tree. Oh. Uh, tired, drinking, driving, drugs. Oh, just Jessica. All of the above, probably. There's a long history of in and out of jail. Oh, that's too bad. He's oh, 53 well. and spent the majority of his life in an institution as a ward of the state. Unbelievable. What are you all about? Couldn't, oh, he's a good kid, bad, couldn't stay off drugs. Definition of an addict. Yep. <clears throat> Just got married two months ago. To a woman he never really? met from, to a woman he never met from Colombia. They met online while he was in jail. Is, is, is she listed on his insurance though? I don't think he has any. Oh. <laughs> wow. But she's getting working papers. 
I think it's a scam. But maybe not. Who knows? I'm too cynical right now. Hey, all my uh, crochet crocheters out there. Hey, Cliff, hold on a sec. I'm talking about crochet for a second here. Okay. <laughs> have you guys heard of Irish? Have you guys heard of Irish crochet yet? Because uh, I just got approved this uh, place on Facebook. It's called Irish Crochet, and look at that. Damn. I mean, that's phenomenal. Hello, Mr. Cone. Doesn't look like a woodworking project to me. You know what? Doesn't matter. But like, it, it it's it's like it's like lace and and. It, it, it's like freaking look at that it's it's all crocheted say it say it it's called it's called irish crochet so if anybody has uh pointers on on uh, how to help me with this that's what i you know that's the that, that's what i would like to because that would be like what the area i'd like to go into because it's just i can't i can't be irish crochet if it's in a straight line it's not a I straight can say line that irish. I can say that I'm Irish. <laughs> say it. But if anybody knows about Irish crochet, let me know. Because like that's like the type of stuff that I want to get into. Oh look, they, they, they even do granny squares. Just saying. Just saying. So it's still like regular it's still, still like regular crochet. I'll catch up with hey, my Cliff, how's it going? When, hello, how the flake and fluck are you? <laughs> oh, see? Connie says she's done that. It was the first kind of crochet she did. What? Connie's done a lot. Oh, no. I was also looking at uh, this fancy double Tunisian well, or this fancy double Tunisian crochet. It's like, it looked weird to me too. And there was a cube crochet as well. I'm like, Wah! all right. Hey, hey, <laughs> Cliff, how's it going? How the hell are you, man? Hey, Chris, Arthur, John. Annie, Jekka, Jeannie, hey, you weird girl. Uh, uh, hot damn, Elaine, Herb, Larry, Debbie, uh, Mr. Combs, Liz, uh, uh, <laughs> Lisa, uh, and stuff. Um, Tracy. Jeannie, w was it a dime? Was, was it a dime bag? Maybe Mike. Just curious. Just curious. Jeannie did a bag. Here's your bracelet, Miss Jeannie. I guess that doesn't look good. nine inches. <laughs> Wait, Cliff. <laughs> Cliff, <laughs> Cliff, Cliff, stroke it, let it, <laughs> let it hang down. Get a Close stroke and let it. Get <laughs> but it matches yeah. her earrings and color. I want to get let it see all. Get let it. No, that that one's nine nine nine, nine inches, isn't it, for her wrist? Yep. Her wrist is eight. Yeah. She wanted, uh, yeah. wanted nine. There's just never enough. <laughs> it, uh, it, <laughs> I, I want to see the I want to see the full nine inches that Cliff's given uh, Cliff's given Jeannie. Here. Yeah, you, you, you uh, hope my camera can pick yeah. it all up. Oh, look at that! Look at that, Jeannie. That a full nine inches you're getting from Cliff. For real? Oh, you're so thank lucky. you, Mike and Elaine. And thank you, Daddy. For real? There you go. Thank was, you, Daddy. I'm a battle. <laughs> you're welcome, baby girl. Hello, just wait until Greg. She orders a, just wait until she orders the full 12 inches next, though. Hey, That's going to be a, I'll an make, issue. I'll make a foot for you. I don't give a damn. <laughs> I'll make a damn uh, garter belt a a waist chain, a harness. Hey, you just get with me. Hello, Greg. Hey, How the hell are you, Chris? Oh, yeah. oh I'm, I never turned my camera back around. I'm getting ready to start uh, Jeff's bracelet. Got the rings open. <coughs> All right, I'm going to go over that side of my shop and work on get my pattern ready to go uh -oh. before I can oh so hey chris i got a question for you yeah. do you wear gloves during 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 your job i wear them here i wear them there well, absolutely are are you, are you afraid of, are you afraid of infecting them or getting infection on them <laughs> or yourself absolutely Crit okay. critters don't die they get they get stronger Okay. 
I don't want staff. Staff? You need more staff. <laughs> this week. What am I doing? Uh, John, you just went. I don't back. know. You put the gloves on. Oh, well, now you're. They changed cameras. Ah. Well, you know what they say. Okay. Once you go black. Once you go black, just just give it a second. It'll come back. <laughs> Something like that. Yeah, that's what I heard. Yeah, we'll go with that. What? Ah. No. Ah. All right. I've already got bugs in here, and it ain't even got good and dark. Some of my bitches. Okay, I've got the class. Okay, Jeannie, some, I mean, Jekka, there is some assembly required. Yeah, I'll lock it down. So, Cliff, did you eat good last night? I, I did. How much longer were y'all on after I had left? I never go to eat in the middle of having video chats and stuff, but I was hungry. Usually I would just throw my stuff in the, on the floor. No, I'll float on the floor over there. It's still dirty. I haven't cleaned outside the floor yet. I gotta move my kit. Uh, crotch cam, crotch cam. Ah, if you could see past the gut. Some assembly required. Yeah, there's a lot of rings here. You may want to get some pliers. I fell asleep about 6.30 this morning. It was a little after 4, and then I took a melatonin, so I slept till damn near 2 o'clock. Jekka, you'll actually get to see oh, your, deep sleep. your sling come to life, or by saying I mean your bracelet. Hello, twice, twice. Yeah, I gave you the, the dumbed down version, Jackie. You got to put it together yourself. Sort of. <laughs> well, yeah, well, then I'll send you a bunch of yarn, asshole. That's <laughs> what she's thinking. <laughs> <laughs> we'll pay for it in yarn. John just, oh, Cliff can just send it to John. What? You what? You're going to send me free yarn? What? No, I said because we're trading a bracelet for a, a peanut character. She, if I sent it to her like this, she would just send me a bunch of yarn. Just send her all the loose rings. Okay. Mr. Larry is leaving us. Earbugs is low. Bye, everyone. Stay safe and blessed prayers for everyone. Have a good Bye. night, homie. And he says, Art, I was bragging on your puzzles today. What's that? What? He was bragging on your puzzles today. Oh, really? Where, where's that at? I was gone all day. Yeah, I, I needed that too, Jenny. I needed every girl darn day. Art. Art, did you say you were gone? Gone, gone, gone. You were gone so long. You were gone, no, gone, gone all day. That sounds shit about here, John, I left here at uh, right around 6.35 and I got home right around 5.30. Hours, man. It was a little long. It was a little further away than most of them. Well, I, I thought it was. Oh wait, uh, the last one was forty-five minutes away, wasn't it, or something like that? Three blocks away, or something you said? Uh, no, the one last week was about twenty-five minutes away. Oh, okay. The one before that was three miles away. <laughs> this went. This one was about uh, 40, 40, 45 minute ride. But it started an hour earlier than the normal ten o'clock that I go to. She said it to people she was it? talking. Sorry. What's that, John? Did you have a ticket? No. A ticket to ride? No? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, <a> <laughs> 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 They'll throw a glyph off with songs here. 
Uh, Annie said, uh, said it to people she was talking to today, Art, various people in the store and at the pharmacy. They're going to come from all angles now. You go, boy. Art had a ticket to ride. Uh, Jack, I hope this color scheme is looking as good as we hope it does. Well, we're starting on the elephant first. We're going to do that and then do the drums. The elephant that plays the drums. That's impressive. I've seen one. Elephant the room. The yeah, elephant room yeah, yeah. Talk to. And she says, I... My niece had a show last Saturday. She's been working for a month making bags. Two vendors showed up and no one else. Damn. <laughs> it was fun last night. It was. Two vendors? Wow. Did any customers show up? Get a lot of get a lot of foot traffic. Yeah, in my town it's nothing but fans and not buyers. Oh, that's so pretty. And move on to the next booth. Kiss my <laughs> Yeah, and around here, Cliff, they tell you it's too much. Well, they'd probably say it by on the back. But that's, why I got to drive. that's why I got to drive 25 minutes or more instead of five minutes. As my dad would say, they can kiss my go to hell ass. Hello, YTF, the Chris. Hey, Chris. Herb's dinner is done. He uh, is now for the. Hello, Chris. He has to change his name. Why? <laughs> it's a lousy name. Oh, that's some old spice right now. <laughs> Gotta put some deodorant on. Appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. Wow. You can't smell me. I don't even want to try. When you smell yourself, you know it's bad. That smells good. Hey, I have a question. Okay, here's a question for people. Do you guys change deodorant brands and soap brands when something new comes out? Do you guys change brands or whatever? I've been oh, using the same oh. deodorant for bricks since 90, 91. Gillette, Cool Rain, right? They change. They 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 change something in it. it. It's got more more zinc oxide in it now, which really pisses me off. Because it actually changes. It stains my my shirts now. Huh. I guess you better just go with shirts and that and see. Oh my god. Back drop. Have you guys ever been around anybody that uses those, those, those natural deodorant stones, though? It's like nope. a rock. Natural deodorant rock. I'm like, you're putting a rock in your armpits. Is this supposed to stop you from freaking... You're like, oh, it makes you smell so much better. Like, no, no, it doesn't. Trust me. I got a rock. Probably I got a rock. I got a rocket in my pocket. <laughs> Oh, I just cleaned my floor. Why am I throwing garbage on the floor? Fuck. Because you got room now. Old habits, right? My rich is with us. Oh, love it. Lisa's leaving us. Good lord. Thanks, Lisa. Hola, Maritza. Hello, Maurice. Y'all take, take care now down under there, right? I'm just, I got a message from somebody. I've just tried to catch it. Watch out for them guana. Okay. Frankie, guana. <laughs> ah, crap.
Should not have done that. Oh my god. Hello, Miss Colleen. Steve will be RB. I'm gonna I'm gonna stoke a smoky while I talk to this person real quick and then I shall return. Does anybody know if China is feeling better today? I'm not the one to ask for that. I'd be asking that uh, girl that starts with J on her name. Jekka. Jekka Khan. <laughs> yep. Jekka Khan. Getting another order because they wrote through my face, but. <laughs> Copyright strike. We don't allow good singers here. Name the tone. <laughs> I knew he was going to answer. <laughs> I'd still like to get with you sometime and hear more stuff about your job. It'll have to be offline. <laughs> oh, yeah, you, you had said that. Come on, Chris. Just, just, just say the one line I want to hear. He's dead, Jim. No. <laughs> Wrong. Wrong movie. Uh, hey, Jim, I'm a doctor, oh, not a brick what, what, what the hell is his name? Um, Bones? Uh, the, the movie Talk. with Bruce Willis. 
Yeah, that's the uh, one. Which, which one? Yippee Kyle Kaye. No. Oh. He's been the in Christmas a few movie. movies. The one, the, the one where the kid sees dead people. Oh, the sixth sense. The sixth six sense. sense. Just say, I see dead people. <laughs> All the time. <laughs> Ain't the dead ones that bother you. <laughs> I smell dead people. They don't know they're dead. Oh, these know. <laughs> they know they're dead. <laughs> look, look at that. That, that. That's almost life size, eh? Just ripping. <laughs> Uh, Colleen, right? Colleen, Colleen. I can remember that. This morning on another show. Even I can remember it. Who's going? But everybody was saying hi, Naughty. Hi, Naughty. I'm, I'm going through, going. Who else? Naughty, Naughty, Naughty. Hi, Nadia. Colleen, why don't they just say hi, Colleen? Hi, Colleen. Nadia. <laughs> you just throw me off. Oh, right. Nadia, oh Nadia. Why did I get rid of you? <laughs> it doesn't have the same ring. I screwed these up. I was, I was going to cut these together, but I don't want to. Found one chisel. Not the right one, though. Found two chisels. Not the right ones. <coughs> Go fancy, go fancy, go. Cool. Yep. Yeah, welcome to John's world. So there's one unfinished project. Here's two unfinished projects. Just set them aside for now, because uh, I got a new project to start. Everybody go! Yay! New project. Jack. Yay, new project. Yay. Yay. John, you're the best. And unfinished Thanks, project. Thanks, Cliff. Thanks for being my cheerleader there. I appreciate that. I did. I, I, I love <laughs> you, man. All right, let's start with this one first. This one, I basically got to do the outline first. So I can do it bigger on the backer piece there. Oh, and then maybe I'll think about doing Josh an actual one too, right? Herbie drank my freaking beer again. Ah, oh, damn. Steve, I remember when you tried to blame me for that one too. That was back when I had beer in my shop. That girl. Early beer, though, you know, you know, early beer. I'm talking about. No, not Cooper's Light. <laughs> That's the silver bullet. <laughs> no, not Bud Light. <laughs> <laughs> You're not getting my Bud Light. Why John, what are, why, John, what are the girly beers there? Oh, it was near beer. It was not, not, not the whole beer. Oh, wait. I need a picture first. Yeah, and uh, Annie, when I've done this, I could, I'll send you the video. So you can show it to him being made, too, as well. So there you go. All right.
I'm trying to finish up now. I apologize for your missed comments. And he says, all day, all night, over and over. Pretty sure I can name the title and episode of all of them after all these years. The Super Grover episode. Super Grover? Yup. Grover was always not. Was his life? His hope. <laughs> all day, all night, over and over. Pretty sure I can name the title. Uh, I was very. Cliff, he watched Robin Hood men in tights 645 times. I don't even think I could handle that more than once. I'm not even 100% sure I could. <laughs> and, uh, a full once. Herb is going to be lurking in the background working on a pattern. We'll sing every once in a while, Herb, so you remember we're here. Pass. <laughs> Steve Combs, Cliff, don't, don't make like you don't enjoy men and tights. I don't anymore. I gave that up hours ago. Debbie's doing her supper. Lydia. All right, Cliff, don't make it like you don't enjoy men in tights. <laughs> it does. <laughs> Hello, Lydia. Hello, Lydia. Encyclopedia. <laughs> Lydia, the tattered lady. Oh, damn. <clears throat> We may have to move, uh, John. Why? (laughs) 
You'd, you'd have to check the chat to know. No. <clears throat> Oh, All right, how loud do you cuss when you make a wrong cut? <laughs> how loud? How loud do you curse when you make the wrong cut? There's, there's no wrong cut. Exactly. I usually, if if I cut something wrong or it breaks, I usually just throw it across the room. Fuck me. <laughs> and say words I couldn't say on the live. But I almost got the elephant down already. Connie says she's 75% finished with her raised garden bed. And there's a dog stretching the gate. Shocker. John, when you get a chance, check Messenger. And you'll know what I was talking about. Talking to they sell. Oh, uh. Yeah. Check as soon as I get this long enough, I'll hold it up to the camera and see if you still like the color scheme. I swear someday it'll be long enough. <laughs> I'm there. drinking milk. <laughs> That's why I said it that way. I'm a big boy now. Tell me a lie, Pinocchio. Ooh, I found a flawed ring. I love it when I catch it in time. Turns out it was just dust. Both alarm. Connie's editing her video for tomorrow. And he says, this yarn that I went on is killing me. So many pretty colors this year. Wait, what? What? Whoa, 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 whoa. Crafty and I heard. This, you, this, <laughs> this yarn diet I went on is killing me. <laughs> I, 
I heard yarn hole. I'm like, what? Oh. I would have been here sooner, but on my way back from the house and eating, my mom put me to work. <laughs> Howdy, folks. Mr. Billy is here. Hello, Billy. Hi, boy. Oh, Billy, Billy boy, bastards. Billy boy. Little Billy bastards. Young Guns 2 reference. My apologies. Hey, you put me and Jack in the same sentence, you lazy bastard. Jessica says she's shopping ice yarn right now. Apparently Marty popped in too, or somebody's... Holy crap, yeah, she's... Hello, <laughs> Marty. And I had to turn off the browser. I was way too tempted, said Annie. And Colleen's on Wool Warehouse Danger. Okay, now they're talking amongst themselves. Marty's prepping wood proposals. Who is the fourth? Uh, Chris Nealon. Yeah. <laughs> Billy was curious who the fourth person on the screen was. <laughs> Hi. At least I know you're looking up ten legs. Billy said, I thought that looked like his hand. Great <laughs> time. Annie, I do that all the time, eat the same food every day. I'm I'm easy and cheap to feed. Hey Billy, where can you get some turn between center pushing adapters? Me too, sometimes, isn't it? I would answer you, Chris, but I'm sworn to secrecy. I know. You understand. You'd have to shoot me if you told me. I know. Yeah. <laughs> and you'd be the dead person you were working on, and that would be awkward. All right. Uh. Huh? Search, search, search. Yeah, Billy. Billy said your wish is my command and put tbcbushings.com link. Yeah, I just found that link as he was speaking. 18 bucks. Wow. I'm assuming I need the you know, 7 millimeter adapter or 8 millimeter adapter. I'm going to guess 7, but I really don't know anymore. Tell them Billy sent you. Worth every dime, he says. Coke float sounds good right now, said Herb. It does. I haven't had a Coke float or a root beer float in forever. <coughs> well, I'm going to use my own bushings, just use the adapters for them. Depends on the pin you are turning. <laughs> to. Basic Sierra. You're basic. What? You're basic. basic. Yeah. It's a pet I'm giving away. 
<laughs> what adapters? Billy they, they, they have adapt they have adapters where you can use your regular pen Billy, pushing. Billy, you like want to talk to them. You know you know it's easier, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Link. How much easier? <coughs> yeah. I guess Billy's gonna be comment, Ritter. <laughs> I don't know. I think it mixes up with a 20A bushing. I use standard Sierra bushing for turning between the centers. Like an A. I totally do too. Like an A. Like an A. The cone center holds them straight. Uh, hey, Billy. <laughs> oh, Billy's here. Look at that. Long time <laughs> We're going to hijack his show. All right. Here's what I do. For Sierras, <clears throat> you know I only turn between centers. Yeah. So I just use my standard Sierra bushings. Yeah. And I put it in between a 60-degree live center and a 60-degree dead center. Okay. You don't need anything else. Now, if you if you're especially anal for one reason or another and think that you have to have something yes, yeah. exactly. And think that you have to have something a little more sophisticated than that, you can chuck the Sierra bushing up. <clears throat> uh barrel end in the pin jaws yeah and get what they call uh oh come on <clears throat> it's those little short double-sided machinist drills they are 60 degrees and they use them for starting holes oh yeah yeah uh a center drill that's what you're called yeah so you can get a a, a a large center drill quarter inch or a little bigger and and you can chuck that up and you can ream the back of that bushing so that it has a little 60 degree cant on it i have done that but it isn't necessary you can just chuck your standard bushings up and go to town but i saw a video the other night where they have the adapters <coughs> Your regular bushings would go on to. I've never used those. Uh, it, it pretty, well, it's basically a, a stub with a seven millimeter bar on either end of it. Anyway, if you could learn more. The, the more, to me, this is just the fat boy talking. To me, the, the more pieces you have in the middle yeah. or oh, yeah. involved, the, the more risk you enter into the picture for having eccentricities in your turning yeah so, like using adapters in the truck yeah i don't i think it's a i think it's a way to make people feel better and make a little right. money I, I don't and we know no, we, we know chris is not known for his eccentricities <laughs> hello little red uh, you, you don't know him like i do <laughs> 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 Jekka, when I make sure you're here, I'm going to show you what I've got so far. John, if Jekka says she's here, do you mind if we go full screen so I can make sure she likes the way? Oh, my God. Oh, dear Lord. Dear Lord. Let me do. You're so demanding, Clifford. I asked him. This isn't the, this isn't the Clifford show. <laughs> well, I don't. I don't have a way to talk to her. I just want to see okay, if she likes. Jekka. No, Jekka, you're wrong. You little bastard. Uh, uh, you're, yeah. talk, you're talking. Oh, that's her, her, her thing. <clears throat> What's that supposed to be, Cliff? It's the beginning the of a bracelet. bracelet. Oh, okay. Scared me. I thought it might be an it's, earring. I'm thinking that lobster claws are a little big. It's a, it's a stitch or, marker. Like a, bra <laughs> like a bracelet. It, it, it's a bracelet bud. I just got to say, yeah. not a callus on that hand. Hi, Jess. You're an yeah, asshole. Yeah, we, we bring Your hand oh. from the ship. No, I 
Thank you, uh, Colleen. I know what work is. I just don't share that. It's outside. <laughs> is it Hello, little talking? red. Okay, so. Now, what was that blank you were showing me, Chris? That was, uh, what was it? It was beach. I give up. It was beach, but it, it, I, I stabilized it and died of the cactus juice. Oh, cool. What color did you die? Green. I have, you, I'm have. i making 15. Color green. Hey, red, how's it going? Rotary yeah. Student of the Year project. Ah. And the school colors, and I'm, I'm an alumni of that school. But we did look that. Green and gold. The green the air with the gold the air with the green pen play. Cool. I'll turn them. Make sure you pick the one. Well, what was this? Was the beach punky or something, or did you just want to no, die? I, I just need yes. a green. There's one that doesn't say. Because like I've turned a number of beach pens, and that that beach is hard stuff. Yes, it is. It, it don't need no stabilization, and my God, it's no, hard. I did it just to get it dyed, and I yeah. wanted it dyed all the way through, so that I was just gonna. I was considering just wiping the dye on before I finished it, but. And it never works as well. Spalted beach is gorgeous. Yeah, yeah. But a lot of those are spalted. <clears throat> My the the drawer fronts on the on the night tables that I made or nightstands, three door nightstands in my bedroom are are spalted beach and they are absolutely phenomenal. Hold on, I gotta grab a plate. Uh well, when he gets back, I just want to read a comment somebody wrote to him. If that's okay. Yeah. Why is it bad? No, no it's just I try to keep up with comments for the people. No. Naughty Naughty said something. Hello. <laughs> Good night, Nana. Naughty and Nutty or something like that, yeah. She's our kind of Maybe. naughty or nutty. <laughs> no, she's just naughty, naughty. <clears throat> I think what you were seeing yeah. is the, was the, the, the green. Uh, they look black, but I think he, those are the what he dyed green and stabilized. Oh, really? But we'll see in a minute. She said naughty and nutty works well, or naughty, any of the above. Yeah, well, you are one of She's definitely a, one of us. <coughs> yeah. I, I, I choose Gooba -gooba. Gooba -gooba. John would say, yeah. <laughs> okay, Chris. Those... I, can't find, I can't find the one I wanted to find. This isn't really worth showing you. The the blanks that were on your bed. Find the one you love. Black, those are are those the That's green dyed? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's what I thought. The one that I want. Oh. This should be dry. Yeah, nice. Like My last wife said that at the wedding. I couldn't find the one I want. All right. What was it? The one that I want. That, is that spalted <laughs> beach? That bowl that you that? It, it is, but you know, it's um. She said, "Oh, now I see." Not the, yeah. It's not the one oh. I wanted to find. It doesn't really show much here. Now I, I see I have, the green again. Okay. So then. <laughs> <laughs> My, these songs are just going through your head, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> I just got to sing one line. Yes. That throws you right off. Well, it's funny, though, because most of the time we think of the same song, unless I'm not familiar with it. Oh, holy burly. What kind of burl that is? It's a burl. Cherry. You're so burly. Oh, cherry burl. That's the smaller of the two halves. It's not a tool, my. Cool. Okay. Are you going to. Are you going to try to use a pressure washer to get the bark off? Or? I don't know. I don't want to take the bark off and just turn it off. He's probably got a debarker 7,000. <laughs> I don't know. Like I, not, I, I, not I he said, oh my, what a burly burl. If you go to the top of the page. Yeah. Burly burl, you have there. Why would you just <laughs> cut, cut one edge off so it's flat? And just make a bowl out of the center part. Just, now, just leave all that outside side, bark on there. Say day. Eh, it's not that pretty. No. Nah. Uh, the burl itself looks better than the bark day. almost always. Yeah. I watched yeah. these guys <laughs> and days chilling the bark off just to get to it. No, the, 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 the best way from what I have been told and 
discovered yeah, is to just try to wash. pressure wash it off. Did you take it to the car wash. wash. Uh, take it to the truck wash because they got they got higher higher psi pressure washers. I, I like and they don't need to pay and girls. Girls. They do it for you. <laughs> take it to the cow wash. Tie a string to it, tow it behind my truck. <laughs> I have that. Uh, oh, okay, we, we, oh, oh, hold on a sec. We got to talk about the elephant in the room here. It's an elephant. What if it's done? You misspelled it. Just kidding. Just kidding. Looks good, homie. Elephant. Now we're going to do, uh, we're going to do the drum kit. Oh, cool. Oh. Drums. That won't, that won't take long. I should be done before John. <clears throat> is, is that a Sylvan symbol on that? New Orleans, Jacksonville Bay, Grand Cayman. Yeah, just that one. So it only shows. What drum kit is that? It's pretty small, Sylvan. Uh, it says uh, Ludwig. Okay, if you scroll down, oh, Ludwig. <laughs> <you're looking laughs> <for the> one, <laughs> it's it's the <laughs> it's a start. It's a starter set, John. Yeah. Mm. And you know what's nice about this one? We only got yeah. one drill hole. <laughs> no, a base of snare and tom tom. Yeah. Okay, we'll go with that. You, you, well, you, stutter you know how much? Tom. You know how much I don't I don't know these things about musical instruments. We discussed this the other day about musical instruments. I'm not musically inclined. Yeah. Cliff, it's not nice to talk about my thinking impediment. Not done. Oh, oh, wait. I, I saw something. I'm non musically inclined. And every time I, I think about that, I cry. Yeah. I wish Charles would need but it, but it was double drop because I, 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 I used the word Klein in there. Come on. That was the best. I graduated and it was so much fun. Oh, uh, and you actually, there's a lagoon. If you want to go back to it, actually. No, but I'll be crying. 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 I knew Elvis was still crying. alive. Crying. Oh, Never mind. I'll stop. To the high part, really. Yeah. I, I can't hit it's, those notes okay. anymore, Chris. <laughs> it's not yeah. Hard. No, I used to could I used to could do it really easily, but uh, my asthma won't let me do that anymore. I'm, I'm going to be leading a bunch of old and some young Rotarians in a version of the Lion Seeks the Right on Token. Ah. And I'm doing it as the token. <laughs> the lion sleeps tonight. <laughs> I used to could hit the same falsetto notes as Frankie Valley. I can't do that anymore. So can he. He's 90 years old, still touring. I know. When I was 14, I could do I could do the wee writ with my actual voice, and it sounded like a whistle. Then my balls drop. Thank you for not having a visual. I heard Steve said, bits to sit on your nuts, Billy, that'll help. Uh, it does on occasion because it happens when I get in my wife's car very often. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what it is about the passenger side of her car, but I get in and I'm, I mean, like, you sure that's not a saddle? Seventy for seventy-five percent of the time. Ah! Getting older sucks. <laughs> I, I just say, oh, they they used to call me Ferdinand the Bull. But now they just oh my god. 
<laughs> oh my god, that's so bad. <laughs> Looking forward to spot. Welcome to Me church too, chat with Me John and Liam. Uh, <clears throat> the other thing I want to know is how do, how do the wood turners keep the, on, on YouTube keep their lathes looking like they're still new? Mine looks like it's been thrown up on. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't know how they do thing is, they they, <clears throat> they, have, <laughs> they actually have two lathes. One lathe is for the beginning part where they just throw it on there. Then they cut it on another one. Then they go back to the same one again. It, 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 it's called editing, like a cooking show. Uh, about here's one we prepared earlier. Yeah, my, my thirty-five twenty, Chris. About every other, about every other year, I have to take a bench chisel and a hammer and chisel the the CA and glue yeah. off of the banjo because it just builds up. I thought you said a bitch. And, did you say a bitch banjo. chisel? <laughs> he did. No, bench, he did. B E N C H bench chisel. <laughs> and but also yeah, twice I heard, a year I, I, though, I will one. twice <laughs> a year I will sand the, the ways down with six hundred grit and use Johnson yeah. paste wax. No my ways are in good shape. Oh it's okay. just the headstock. It looks like <clears throat> yeah, my headstock isn't quite that bad. You son of a bench chisel. But I don't spray finishes on it either. Well, if I do, I take a cardboard box that I cut a slit in the back and I set it down behind the behind yeah. the chuck. Brown and I don't know what it is. Probably one of the oil finishes. Yeah, it could be one of the oil finishes you used. Hello, Liz. Yeah. I have not tried it yet. Uh, that I don't, and I need to. I need to email Tom and ask him. Okay. I don't think message he's him. Auto, I think he's taking it off too soon. I, I need to message him and ask him. Okay, why did you? Why did you name? Why did you name this middle step or second step or whatever yeah. he named it? Should be a first. If 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 you're putting it on first, I mean yeah. this is, uh, that's like a major oxymoron. I don't get it. This kaleidoscope is with us. Sorry, I, I didn't know. Chris came. <laughs> I see other people using tongue oil after sanding. Thanks, sanding. That John. doesn't make sense to me either. But... No. John, thank you for letting me show Jacka. Because well, sometimes people I've think used, they're going to like a dark demon. No, sorry, go ahead, Billy. I've used tongue oil. Pure tongue oil, no yeah. dryers, no nothing. I've used pure tongue oil as a finish. There's oil in my tongue. <laughs> you just, you just. The only problem is I knew, I knew I'd get you that one. Stuff in it. Because <laughs> it doesn't have dryers and stuff in it, you've got to let it wait 24 hours between coats, and it may take seven, eight, nine, ten coats <laughs> to get you a nice finish. And no wood turner wants to wait that long. No. Nope. If you're making fine hardwood furniture, I mean, you know, furniture we'll and stuff, that's different. Drying in a, we'll, piece, we'll have the piece of wood drying for five years in the corner, but we won't take a week to finish it. Right. <laughs> I got wood drying in my shop for five, six, eight years. I've got <laughs> wood <laughs> been drying. I've got wood in my shop for about 20. <laughs> that girl's been five years under my shop, sir. <clears throat> La, 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 la. That looks. Oh, hello, Greg. Just, just from the angle, that's a drum set. I was thinking that looks kind of yeah, like the no. forward view of a semi. <clears throat> but no, no. actually, Billy, that's right here. Yeah, yeah, but that's not the forward view. That's side view. <laughs> Gosh, I gotta. This is the one that uh, Art by Connie bought. So I, yeah. I'm making another one now. Yep. Oh. Making, making another rig big. And and there's there's the uh, line work truck that I sold last week. So I got to make another one of those. The white awesome. teen dealer. <laughs> Excuse me. Busy, busy, busy man. 
Chris K said, John, do you really lick your wood? Man, I missed him. Okay, what? Hello, Jeannie. If they could, you'd never see him. Yes, Chris. Charles, don't you? you is, if you don't uh, taste Charles it, you don't know what brand, what flavor it is. Hey, you know it's Charles cherry, not Charles apple. Gotta lick it. Turkey, he's sleeping. Yeah, he went to bed right after the last one. Uh, I'll be <laughs> Facebook. I will be right there. Trust me, Chris. If you could lick my wood, you would. <laughs> if you could. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What if he could? Yeah, but he can't. So, people always ask me how I came up with my name. Oh, I'm my sorry, God, Judy, I didn't good. see it. <laughs> my esteemed apologies. <laughs> the chat was going by pretty quick. Oh, <laughs> Colleen, I used to be pretty flexible in my younger days. I've never been. But then effect. again, oh, like Cliff God. said, you know. It's only one thing that's flexible. Yeah. I'd do it if I could. Uh, I'd do it if I could, but then I realized that I had something in my mouth. Jeannie, I replied. Oh, really? <laughs> she forgave you. Woo Guy was watching his wife's dog lick himself one night, and he said, I sure wish I could do that. And his wife said, well, he might let you if you ask him real nice. <laughs> See, I don't want to do that because then I'd have stuff in my mouth I don't want in my mouth. <laughs> We're going down the rat hole. Well, it's like, <laughs> back, back, to, back to Billy's joke. So there, was, uh, there was an old bull and a young bull. Sitting on top of the hill, and young bull says, "Hey, why don't we go right down there and buck all them heifers?" The old bull says, "Whoa, whoa! Why don't we walk down there and make love to all of them?" You butchered that joke. I know the joke you're talking about. <laughs> yep, he did. Yeah. What's the moral <laughs> yeah, of the story, was, though? You're supposed to run down the hill. Fucking time. Well, that, I saw that joke on the movie Colors, and it's uh, let's go down there and fuck that cow. And then he says, how about we walk down and fuck them all? Well, a, a, a 90-something-year-old farmer whose ranch I was working a well on once upon a time told me that joke. And he said, you remind me of that young bull. I said, what young bull? <clears throat> he said... Young bull told the old bull one day, he said, why don't we run down there and jump that fence and have us some of those heifers? He said, the old bull said, why don't we walk down there, crawl under the fence and have them all. You screwed it up though. <laughs> no, Steve, Combs said, it. Steve Combs said, missing a few ribs, John. Well, <laughs> 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 I don't know, maybe the first time I heard it, it was wrong, but it was in a movie. No, it's not the ribs you got to worry about. It's the length that you're gagging on. <laughs> I'm glad to say I've never had that problem. That old man was something else. His name was Andy Broyles, an old cowboy. I mean, an old cowboy. This was, this was in 1980... This was in 1982, and he was 92 years old. So uh, he, he'd been around a long while. The one, the one I heard was from Robert Duvall on the movie Colors. Hello, Will. Yeah. And Angel and is stories. Nervous. Oh my God, that old man had stories. Hello, Angel. I, I, Hello. I love just sitting and listening to him. He'd come out. He'd come down to the trailer every morning and have coffee with me. Angel. I still got that song stuck in my head, Billy. Oh, uh, sorry, I got something in my throat. That's what she said. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, just yeah, honored it, reached her throat. <clears throat> Surprised I was first with that. 
<laughs> These younger generations will never know the oh god privilege of <laughs> of sitting and talking to old cowboys, the, the, you know, old old cowboys or. Uh, <sighs> Sorry, I'm laughing at Jeannie's comment. She said, "John, or, what a view! Oh, Thanks oh, for sharing." Yeah. Or old guys that are like a couple of the World War, a couple of World War II vets, B seventeen crew that I used to bowl with that I would sit and talk to. Be honored. I'm here with everybody. Those guys were awesome too. We had a lot of that with the with the Navy base being next door for us. Yeah. Oh, these were these were this was they were all they were all they all flew in b-17s they were all shot down over germany it was it just god i love talking to him <laughs> colleen said he was proving he still had all of his ribs Gene. yeah <laughs> it's really bad when you get an old person telling a story and you it doesn't make any sense and then they will not stop telling the story Oh, be creative. Oh, Pam is back with us. It's been a while. Be Hello, right. Pam. Hey, Pam. How do you do? Be right. Pammy, Pammy. How's Hello. it going? Hello, Nancy. Hello, Nancy. Nancy. I think oh. a live just ended. Oh, you, you've, been, you've been raided. <laughs> Nancy, <laughs> Nancy. Nancy, Nancy. It's a, it's a B raid. Well, people, I'm going to punch out because I got uh, early morning with the grandkids tomorrow. Don't treat okay. Mary that way for crying out loud. Huh? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I was, I mean, I, you started with punch out, and I'm thinking Mary at the end of that, and that would not be nice. No, no. First of all, if I did, I would. Yes, Mr. King, nothing. <laughs> yeah, I hear you, buddy. <clears throat> Later. Have a good one, Chris. He's a good dude, and his wife's really sweet. Yeah. He actually, we met right before you, Billy. Because yeah. he walked by Charles, said something about pizza, and Charlie didn't realize it was him. Yeah. <laughs> Jeff is with us. Chris oh, said, Jeff. I forgot he read. Jeff Fafa. Hey Pam and Nance, who'd all you guys bring over? Who bring over with you? Let's see Pam and Nance. <coughs> Pam and Nance. I'm glad Chris and Mary are going back over? down to SWAT again this year. Looking forward to seeing them. Heads up, great. Oh, see, so Pam, I know you were oh, all, all kinds of pizza, LOL. I know uh, you asked the question, uh, it was either you or Nancy, who else does epoxy? And I think, you know, uh, because uh, it, was, it was right when I asked, uh, right after Nancy pulled hers out of her mold, I'm like, do you, do you use uh, uh, mold release? Because you asked if anybody does uh, epoxy work. And I'm like, you should go over and talk to the, the wood guys, because they do, Billy does epoxy work. Billy does epoxy work. Yes. I have a boxy. Johnny does they a were, boxy. They were doing, they were doing uh, UV epoxy, like little little medallions and stuff, keychains and stuff. Yeah. Were you over there? Who, you should have been over there it? helping them out. Uh, Pamela. Who was using it? Pammy. Pam. Oh. Pam and Nancy. Oh, <clears throat> the, the best for medallions and stuff, the best brand as far as I'm concerned, don't take trouble, boat. Because I, I I like it because no 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 I don't use that crap. Uh, the best brand, as far as I'm concerned, is because it domes very nicely, which works well for medallions um, among other things. Is Liquid Diamonds? That's my favorite resin to use or epoxy to use if I'm not going to put it in a, if I'm not going to put it in a pressure pot because it takes long enough to cure that it dries literally bubble free. Uh, the bubbles all come come up and pop. Uh, liquid diamonds, by far, is yeah. I I, I, I actually heard that crafters. too. I know. Uh, I, was, I was I was 
I was asking Doug about his UV uh, total boat that he was using too. And he says it's yeah. nice and all, you, but you still got to flame it. And, and, and Nancy flamed hers. Pam just waits for hers to come out. Yeah, with, with total with liquid diamonds, you don't have to flame them. <clears throat> now you can you can flame it. You don't even have to flame it. You can spritz it with alcohol, and that will bring what it does is it breaks the surface tension on top of the resin in it. Sounds like a waste of alcohol. Pop. But yeah, I will. No, <laughs> like isopropyl, but oh, isopropyl, ninety nine percent. Yes. I guess I'm seventy percent. I used to use alumatite. I think that's what it's called. Aluma something. Alumalite. I've used yeah, that that's, too. That, that's that's my back preference. when I did when I did tumblers. That's what I used. My aluminite is my preference if I'm going to. I tumble make, for you. If I'm going to make stuff and cast wood or pieces of burl in it, and I put it in a pressure pot, I like alumalite. <laughs> I love. It. I like it. I'd love yeah, to have yeah. a pressure pot yeah, to do something, but I uh, I use Polyurethane UV resin, resin now. I just haven't used it for anything. Yeah. I've got it's it. Polyurethane resin. It's not an epoxy resin, and you have to put it under pressure, or you'll have bubbles. There's oh. no way around it. Uh, Miss uh, Colleen is leaving us. Good night, Charlie. Colleen, what? I uh, you're leaving us. Billy, I used to every once in a while go in there and night, hit night. it with the a little mini torch to work on the bubbles. Sorry, right, Steve. Take care, man. Oh, wait. Steve and Pauline are doing at the put... same time. Hmm. Oh, nice, Steve. <clears throat> I've, I've never, I've never tried it. Well, I have. I've cast the Lumilite one time without. <coughs> dang, without pressure, and it looked horrible. Mm -hmm. Well, I've only done it on I things mean, it that were. Full of they were turning, and then I did it in a very hot room, too. Now, uh, the Alumilite does make other products that yeah. set up very, very quickly that don't, they're not clear, though. The, they're mm. the white Alumilite that you won't see bubbles in it. But. Yeah, like, I was using uh, the food grade stuff, and then, <coughs> and then it all yellowed right. when I moved, so I just quit doing it. Yeah, the white. And Jeff says he was talking uh, about doing rock, rock polishing. I don't know why. How do we get out of rock polishing, Jeff? I polish my stones from time to time. I used to have a lapidary set up. Uh, uh, Nancy, Nancy says she used uh, Lumilite for her tumblers. Yeah, I did and that for a while, too. Sam says the UV resin as well. UV resin is what we're using tonight because I could do it in the craft room. The other epoxy I have to take outside or open all the windows. Yeah, I just turned a fan on. You'd be okay. I've, I've never, I've never had, I've never used an epoxy resin that had that kind of odor. The only resin I've ever used that had an odor so strong you didn't want to be in there with it was polyester resin, and that stuff is nasty. Mm -hmm. No, Billy, I used to do these cups in a in a small room, and I had two radiator heaters in there, and and then hit them with the torch, too. They came out like glass every time. Hmm. I was kind of known for how quality mine were, but like I said, it was an expensive hobby, and, or not. It was another attempt at a business. It did okay. It just, I yeah, wasn't going to go buy cheap, gallons of it again. Yeah. I had Which a is gallon of each, and one of them yellowed, and I said, okay, we're done here. Because I had moved in the meantime. So. Then I started the decal business. I sold one entire <coughs> decal, so I thought this isn't for me. Huh? That was actually to Josh Grover. <laughs> oh, no wonder. Yeah, polyester resin is actually what? bad. It, you, the, the activator for polyester, polyester resin is, or it's a catalyst, it's actually a catalyst, is MEKP, and it's got toluene in it. And it's, <clears throat> it's oh my God, it's horrible. Long and, and dark, riddle. shining and black.
No, it's clear. Tearing up the highway like a big old dinosaur. Catalyst. Catalyst. <laughs> you got to think, think of the song every time you talk to John. <laughs> Cadillac Ranch. This thing's that knee your deer band? Uh, I don't know. Charlie can probably tell you. I'm not real familiar with they stuff. But he's asleep, and I don't think he'd appreciate us waking him up for a song. <laughs> Wake him up. Just, who sings Cadillac Ranch? Hell <laughs> no. Give it wrong. What kind of message <laughs> were you using? I'll admit when I'm wrong. Stank bad. Jen Reeves said I'm hanging out in my tree house. Lurking. Hello, Jen. <clears throat> Every time I see Jen Reeves, hey, I'm Jen. Thinking, why is my <clears throat> why is my niece here? <laughs> her married name was Reeves before her divorce. And her name is Jen. So I get I, well, I get see, I can think it as Jen. Her. Jen Jen. Uh, Ooh, I haven't heard yeah, from her in a like, long time. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. And actually, I I I was actually talking to her the other day. Oh. Cool, Connie. My kitchen island. I just used <clears throat> one and a quarter inch thick cedar deck board for made a I cut the round edges off and glued it together into a panel <coughs> and coated it with polyurethane uh, yeah uh Jen Barnes that's what I was thinking of yeah yeah <laughs> oh I got a smoky but yeah I'll call you Jen Jen too Yes, yes, Greg, Greg. Con, con. Con, bon, bon. Ann, Ann, Annie, Annie. She's been gin so long. Are you okay? Yeah. Oh, oh Pam. Man, I, if you look at, just glance over the screen and, 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 and see the word Pam, it looks like porn. Like, just, I don't know. Maybe just be me. <laughs> because the M looks like an O, O, R, so close together. My eyes are going off on me. <laughs> you mean you mean I think Andy, you mean getting off on you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll go with that. When my back was spasming. I had to smoke. Oh. When I had to walk away, I decided to smoke. I just had to walk. Did you walk this way? <clears throat> walk this way. Talk this way. <laughs> Got a singer. It's the little things, right? You... <laughs> oh, it's just me, okay? Oh, yeah, okay, Annie, it's just me. <laughs> just you, says Jen, too. <laughs> oh, come on, it's not just me. Oh, wait, I, I asked that question, didn't I? It's just me. <laughs> it's definitely not just you, but yeah, that on, on that one, maybe. get to see any bugs fly in front of my camera not the right camera to catch most of them but hey about two inches more to go and i'll be done with the oven i'm glad y'all got small recesses At the table of small wrists. Huh? Small bracelet. Yeah. I didn't hear the first part is why I was questioning, but I figured it out. At the table of small wrists. First bike ride of the season today. All right, Greg. Feel here, been riding for freaking weeks already, almost a month now. 
I ain't in town, so I don't see none of them. I laugh when they freaking skid on the ice, drop their bike at the freaking lights because they're idiots. <laughs> and, uh, okay, so yesterday, uh, uh, heading up the main street, 60K zone. So I'm doing 60. And out of nowhere, out of, like literally nowhere, this freaking Harley, oh, right by me, must be doing freaking 80, 90. You know, and then we're at the same red light. I'm like, you're a freaking idiot. I glance down at him. He, 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 he looks up, he sees his head nod. Oh, no, yeah, you're cool. Corner, right? <laughs> hey, Susie. Hello, Susie. I'm hanging in the treehouse with all the lurkers, crocheting on a blanket. Oh, wait. There's lurkers out there? What's with the sudden tree houses? Am I missing something? Well, lurkers hang in the tree house. Don't you know that? I guess. I guess you can hide in the bushes, know. but tree houses are cooler. <laughs> yeah, this is true. Oh, we're, we're, because as woodworkers, we built them a tree house. Don't you know that? Come on. Come on. Yeah, yeah. I'm not That's a my story. I'm sticking to it. Okay. I do. But if you had a hammer, would you use it? All day and all night. Turns out I there don't need a hammer that much. What, what about the morning and the evening? <laughs> we were on the same page, just different books. <coughs> Chuck is in the treehouse. I can see that from here. When did they do that? Yes. Well, we were gone, or after. I guess you didn't notice when we drove in, huh? No. It feels nice outside now. Yeah. Okay, count dog. Gosh, golly gee. <laughs> Willikers. And he says, my tree climbing days are over. I just hide behind the fence now. Welcome back, Billy. We missed you. We were crying and everything. Thank you. Welcome. Oh, God damn it. Do my damn camera again. For those who want to watch. Well, Would you go crazy. for a run, Billy? You're out of breath, man. <laughs> oh, no, no. Well, I did walk around a little bit, but no. Yeah. I'm, so, I'm yeah. Uh, 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 Tracy said she's working on a blank as well. So I was uh, in my little, little, little yesterday there i was looking at what stitch is this oh this one oh this is a cool stitch too. this one here this this stitch right here somebody explain to me what she's doing because this looks like a cool stitch she's confusing me that's what she's doing shay is here yeah. hello shay it's been a while hello shay it's, it's almost like it's almost like a rope that she made, right? Does anybody know the stitch? Shay's on from Facebook, if anybody is <coughs> curious why they can't see her. We're in the spirit hey, world, Shay. asshole. Honey, it's not a cool stitch. And look how, look how fast this one is. Uh, Super fast. They had a year earlier. Shit. It's probably time lapse, I know, but <laughs> that's a cool stick. Uh, Annie mm. said a bobble. I'll, I'll take her word for it. A bobble stitch? I want to learn all these. What do you call me? A bobble stitch. Look, look at this cool shell. Look at that. 
Ani says she's doing three stitches in one and then pulling it through. And Jeannie said booble. I don't know if she meant bobble or she's just trying to distract us again. We're gonna are we gonna play ball we're gonna play a game of boggle now. Bobble. Okay now now another one I saw, this one here. Nancy, you're like Na Nancy. <laughs> For Nancy. Look at this cool freaking See, I, I would actually do these in different colors. Like, I would have the yellow in the center and the white on the outside to make daisies for you. Yeah, daisy if you do. It's just like 15 round overs. One, one double stitch through and it pulls it all back through. Look at cool petals. That's awesome. Okay, uh, uh, Chris Kaleidoscope said that mm -hmm. thing was a needle punch. And Jeannie said that's tension crochet. It needs in crochet. Tension. I'm not bright. Johnny <laughs> likes that stitch. Uh, this, is a back. this is a cool one. <clears throat> Lord. That's doily making stuff. Oh my goodness gracious. Wow. Yeah, I couldn't pick that shit up if I wanted to. No, 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 but it's actually pretty, it looks pretty easy, though. And then flip over, uh, flip, and do it again. Yeah, it looks cool when, you, when you're done with this, though. Like, that would make a cool bracelet or an armband or something. Okay, thanks. Come on. You can have it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come for you. And Marty says, I need to make a zero clearance for my saw table. Oh, oh right. Tomorrow. Woodwork. Okay. So, sorry, Marty. Yeah. See, look, look. See? Yeah, this is... Uh, hey, it's good. Cool. Yeah, got the woodwork. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> You're so jealous. You're so jelly. <laughs> You're so jelly. Not even. Like Greg said, that's like tying fishing flies. Thanks, Marty, for uh, bringing us back to reality here. Appreciate it. <laughs> Somebody had to. <clears throat> I should watch a movie, but I'm just too hooked on this now. Keep watching. <clears throat> I don't know who I'm talking about. Somebody's watching Netflix at Billy's house. My advice. I heard the Netflix sound. Yep. Jen brought some popcorn. <laughs> who was it? That's what you told me, is it, Billy? You said, I don't know who I'm talking to. Hey, you're on here I'm with us? You. you said you should watch a movie, but you're hooked on this other thing. Why didn't you acknowledge me? <laughs> I didn't know I had to. Cool. <laughs> oh, sorry. Blank. Uh, Well, I mean, Ooh, take a drink. Jog. Yeah, it's the first one in like three days. Come on. <laughs> See, Susie knows the rules. First time in three days. Marty Zero clearance inserts are not hard to make. For your table saw? Yeah. Morning. Uh, yeah, right. yeah. Or, uh, I don't know if. Morning, Hang on, Chris K. I don't know if I don't I've put any of my earrings in my. my you have some on your website. Group. On your Etsy site? I don't have Etsy. I, know, I, have my own I website, know they're on your Facebook I page. Uh, John Adele said it's not hard to do, John, just a little tedious because it's a small hook and basically thread that you're using, just my two cents. Eyeball punch. <laughs> Chris K, see if this link works. There she goes. The first there she goes. 
She goes again. Well, that's an example of not my genre, but I like on your. Yes. Do what? Like you don't have your Etsy page on YouTube. I, I don't have an Etsy, Etsy store. <coughs> I don't that use Etsy. I have my own website. That explains a lot. But but I but I haven't. I'm a bad. I'm I'm horrible at website stuff. I, I've got a bunch of stuff that oh. I need to put on my website that I haven't yet. Among those are my earrings. Me too. I got over 100 pieces. I got to. And yeah. I keep putting it off and off and off. Oh, you actually don't have a lot of stuff on your Facebook, uh, your website. No, I don't have a whole lot of stuff on the website, unfortunately. Dude, I've got some things. You, 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 you <coughs> got three items plus swag. No, I have more than that. No, that's all you got. Oh. Stop. There was more than that. No, that's all swag. Uh, two bowls there. Crotch bowl, your hackberry, hack, hackberry bowl. Oh, wait, here we go. Boop, 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 bowl, 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 Did you say bowl, a crotch bowl? bowl? Yep, crotch, a crotch bowl. Okay. Your little bowl, birdhouse, ornament. Oh, yeah, there's more than that. Your wings of hope. Yeah, I, I saw it. I see that now. I'm, I'm going through the pages. Hey, you showed us these on, the, you show, you're on my show the other day. Yeah. You know, if you guys buy all the stuff off his website, then he can uh, make some more and do another oh, show on the next year. A lot of those are sold already. Not all of them. I work with horses for a living. I have to admit, I've never seen anything like this. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I have to make a zero clearance for my saw table. And then down here, she says, I have no table saw. So are you talking about your scroll saw? Scroll, a zero clearance for your scroll saw? Oh, um, some Sorry, of them. Your van saw? Oh, scroll saws some, so, some scroll saws have that zero clearance insert plate in them. Uh, they're actually yeah. easier. Oh, what I do, uh, what I do, Artie, uh, let me finish cutting this. I'll show you in a second. Okay. I just use blue tape. Yeah. You're talking for your puzzles, possibly? Yeah, she said she's you making postage stamp puzzles. I just yeah, use I'll, blue I'll tape around the, around, the, around the blade, Marty. Nah, you don't want to do uh, that. After you, you, after you do a few, you may have to I'll replace them. Good. Well, another thing you can do is use a thin sheet of plywood and cut a kerf in it and leave it there. Or clamp it there. I've done that too. John may school us though. The girl in the background said, I need the keys. I thought she said, I need to pee. <laughs> My wife is watching Heartland. She's hooked. I think it was filmed in Calgary. Uh, I, know it was, I know it was filmed in Kanukistani somewhere. They're, they're almost all Kanukistan actors. Actually, I can probably narrow it down to you and say it was filmed in Okotoks. Okay, uh, Marty, zero clearance <laughs> insert. Uh, number one. <clears throat> tape. Blue tape, green tape, masking tape. Put it like right beside your blade, right? Boop, on yep. all four sides. Okay, so run two pieces this way and then run two pieces this way so that your blade is zeroed off. Number one. Number two, use a board, right? You basically, basically cut it in so you got your, your line coming straight into it. Okay, two. Three, use a piece of acrylic plastic, just run it in, and then so it's big enough to cover your whole, the whole table area. That way, it's a, it's a, it's a flusher, it's a more flush area. Number four, easiest, quickest way: take an empty pop bottle, cut the flat section out. Okay, just drill a little hole, drill like a one sixteenth hole in the center of it, and tape it on. That way, it's just more durable for you, and it'll last longer. That way, it, it, you have the strip on here, which is plastic. Put a couple little pieces you can actually use double side tape on the back side of it and put it right to your table that way you got zero clearance single hole through the center of it use the flat part of your ball bottle though okay she said she's thinking acrylic because i have uh i have an acrylic piece here oh right here it is it's acrylic that i i, I drilled a hole through and basically all i do is line it up I'd love to, but I should probably work with that. I'll talk to Tyler. Yeah, I'll do that. Like that. Tape it on. That's all I do. Just try on everything I can about Joe's thing. I need a new piece. I need a new piece of zero. But I got lots of plastic, so. Did the post-op examination after she came back with a term in D.C.? Many multi-uses for the stuff in your house. So whatever's going on with Abby, it's not physical. The rest of the rest of the field works good, too. Just say it. I only worked with Abby for a couple of hours today, and already she's gaining confidence. I'd say in a few days I should have her back to normal. Well, that's good. Yeah. I'm just worried that as soon as Tristan gets back from her, she's going to regress. Well, why do you think that? Tristan broke his collarbone, yes. That's pretty serious. It would have taken him weeks to recover. Maybe probably just as traumatized as that. Maybe more. Jeez. It's possible that we're not even thinking to keep transferring his fear back to that. Gee. Oh, gee. 
Look at that. Look at the puzzle. Whoop. Whoop. Cool. Okay. Oh. Yeah, it's a week time. Oh, I forgot. I forgot an angle. Oh, yeah, totally. Awesome. Yeah, I really need some beer, too. Marty, is this me going to be scrolling on Jim show? Okay. Okay. Still ending with you. That's fine. It's I think I'm going all along that I wasn't the problem. I'm leaving without leadership right, which you need to belong. It's not your fault, but it is. It is your fault. It's always your fault. Admit it. Fault. Jess said today's letter of the day. G. You can come back from this. So can Abby. After she recovers, I think it'll be worthy gestures and I'd be interested in buying her. Pretty sure my Justin days are over. No, I knew it. Okay, so Heartland was actually filmed in High River, Alberta, okay? So I've been to this train station. It's right across from 7-Eleven. They, uh, they, they rebuilt the, the ice cream shack, the, the ice cream shack in Heartland. They actually rebuilt it and renovated it just for the show, and it's still there. Mm. They still use it as an ice cream, and it, it is actually like half a block of up in the uh, uh, the Kiwanis RV park. Cool. Um, so the the downtown the downtown store scenes here. Uh, this was all mm -hmm. rebuilt due to a flood that happened like a, the year before they started filming. But like the, the town literally flooded halfway up. Like the entire first floor of the building down the entire downtown was all flooded because the high hence the name High River. Thank you, John. Hey Art, look at that! Your drum set's done. Drum cool, set's cool. Done. Uh, <clears throat> cool. <clears throat> Chris K said, "Sorry, Billy, I will return to shop because I agreed no shopping while drugged behind fence with Annie." Okay, I gotta, I gotta mute myself here. Okay. <laughs> uh, there you go. And, and this, uh, this High River Motor Hotel is actually a block up from the KFC. Which is the other block away from the Seven Eleven? Yeah. Which they but they don't show that, but that's where it. So yeah, it's filmed in Oak. It's filmed in High River. That's where I pick up my uh, my mother in law every year. Don't go too fast. Thank you, Jessica. And he said, hey, Chris, I got chairs and everything. Guess what? What? I'm getting married. You are? You are? Aw. That's very exciting. Can I go back? Okay, slow the lasagna's in the oven. The salad is done. That, I'd say we're in big shape. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but it's cast and I'm worried about it. Well, she's a lot more mellow than she used to be. I think you guys are rubbing off on her. Uh, hi. What? The oven isn't working. It's stone cold. Oh, uh, no. The must be faulty. Yeah. Hi. Do you want to take a minute? Uh, I don't think so. George, I lost my temper this morning. I'm sorry. It won't happen. Okay. I was the one who screwed up. I guess I mean, it was a lot harder than I thought. Well, you just need a little more confidence in it, that's all. I put something in the truck that might help you with that. 
So, what do you say? Give another try. Well, Actually, I was thinking with school starting up <coughs> and extreme team. Oh. I have to change my plans. Yeah. No, I understand. I don't know okay. if you heard me earlier. I'm so sorry, but can you hear? I think ours isn't working for some reason. Yeah, sure. I told you not to buy your appliances online. Not now, Dad. Oh, I can't hear her. I want my Weasley's knitting needles. Is that a Harry Potter thing? <laughs> Hey, Herbie. Still here. Austin Ohl. Did you hear while filming the movie Titanic, someone spiked the lunch soup PCP? Right? Oh, while filming it. Uh. No, I didn't hear that. I didn't either. <laughs> Things have been a little tense between me and Cass lately. Tell me what happened. <laughs> we had a bit of an argument on the ride over. See, I, uh, I wanted to make a commitment. Or, <coughs> and I'm hoping she wanted the same thing. Turns out she just wants to be guy. Well, I think it's better if you just, you know, take things slow. No. I'm a fast moving guy. I like something I think why not jump in with both feet. God, if she's not feeling it, then why don't you? are rubbing it tonight. Russ. What? I'm driving. Can you see Kirby said, well, the pattern's done. Just waiting on approval. Approval from who? I'm getting up on Tim. I'm hoping Charlie. The pattern. And he said she just got a text from her son. Seems her granddaughter learned something interesting in daycare this past week. Well, thanks for keeping us in suspense, Danny. Yeah, really. Don't be too vague on your answer there. Hey, Russ. Nah. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Hey, why don't you tell Caleb and Cass about uh, your new... Her name's Abby, and... Uh, if, 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 if comments or anything were building up, I, I had to take care of something real quick. Oh. We got to take care of them. Really? Like you wore the armor and everything? Uh, customer. And how did this come about? Oh. Gotcha. Well, no, it's not necessarily a customer yet. It's an idea. Well, no, no. But Herbie was answering the question. Oh, oh okay. <clears throat> I said, who's approval? And he said, customer. It's not all about you, said, Cliff. Relax. Yeah. And he, said she went to the, <laughs> and he said she went to the bathroom, and he asked if she wiped her butt. She said, no, I oh wiped my, my asshole. That's where shit comes from. She's four. <laughs> no, when Billy said a customer, I thought he was saying it to me. Okay, we, we get it now. No, I'm going to have to do a hangout with somebody later to get us on the same page to see if it's something I can't do. Out of the mouths of babes, eh? Yeah. Jen, you going? Night? No. Night. You're going night, Jen. Good night. Good night. Thanks for hanging out with us in the treehouse. We appreciate it. Good seeing you, Jen. Is it one of them fancy tree houses, Jen? Multi floors and stuff. <clears throat> like the cat kind made by the tree house master. 
Is that another reality show I don't know about? Uh, yeah. So, so there, there's, there's a couple of. Uh, yeah, his name is Pete Nelson. He's amazing. There's a couple of of uh, uh, log homes in uh, BC that actually travel worldwide that build these awesome freaking log cabins and tree houses out of uh, uh, BC. BC here. And they got these. Uh, uh, there, there, there's one, what one main structure piece that they call the family tree, that basically has exposed roots that are on the floor of the house that actually yeah, hold the entire thing. And they, they basically they, they, they cut around the tree, probably about eight feet around the base of the tree, and down about eight feet, and then they sandblast all the roots. Every, oh, wow. like, crush your wash, and sandblast and sand it. So, so that you see all the roots in, in the center of the house when you first walk into every house. It's, it's like, like I'm the only one that hasn't seen that. <coughs> and he said, well, the, the treehouse master is Pete Nelson. He's out of Oregon, I think. And he travels around the United States doing them. Um, <coughs> and he said, I can see I'm going to have to have a good talk with her on Wednesday. <coughs> <coughs> and Jen said, yes, four bedroom, three bath kind, LOL. Wow. Well, that's a treehouse. Uh, yeah, y'all greetings from the treehouse has a no, whole different meaning now. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> Just said, yeah, the treehouse guy is awesome. Yeah, Almost done, Jacob. Day. He's done the, uh, three or four here. In the Texas guys from BC, awesome. they, uh, they, they build the houses in their yard so that everything's fully assembled. Then they take them apart, put them in sea cans, and ship them all over the world. And then they travel there and rebuild them for the clients. Cool. Yeah, Everybody in the damn chat has seen them, apparently. Uh, uh, everybody has, everybody has company, scaled that cliff. Three, four Pete's years? company no. builds some of the walls in the shop, in his shop in Oregon, and ships them out after he gets it all designed. Some they build on site, some they build in the, in the shop. Really, how long has he been on? About three, about three, four years. Oh God, four or five years, maybe. Yeah. On TV. Six. Yeah, I would. Now he was on TV before I moved it here, and I moved here in July of eighteen. So. He's on. Uh, uh, now what channel? Yeah, on? Discovery Channel. Yes. Yeah, Everybody in the chat has seen it. I feel yeah. left out. You been sleeping? Did you say, have I been sleeping? Why don't we do no, it like they do on the Discovery Channel? <laughs> Joe said, that, Joe said that show is cool. Jeannie said, I love that show. <clears throat> no, I, I don't have TV service out here, and I won't get much done if I go in there. I just record Wait, a few uh, true crime You got Starlink now. Yeah. They don't do TV. You should have all the channels. What? Yeah, you should technically have access to every freaking TV show out there now. You got Starlink. Well, I'll be, be right back again. If I if I'm watching it on the computer, maybe. While I was over there by the door conducting business, I saw everybody buffered for a second. So I'm wondering if it was switching satellite. <laughs> Because well, they said that's usually the reason for any downtime is it's switching to the next satellite as it loses one. Thank you for your help. I had it three in the morning. What you going to say? Oh, sure. Fine. Yeah. Well, Cass and I were just talking about how nice it is to have another couple to hang out you would, You would think with his world net over the world yeah. that it would just cover everything or they would overlap it. I just, Okay. Yeah, that and you would also think he'd be offering uh, cell service and TV service. But yeah, they the FCC won't let them use the same satellites and stuff as the other ones. That's why they point to the north northwest rather than south south. <coughs> Is who what? Food. 
Spoon. Oh, spoon. Oh, spoon. Oh, this thing? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it this just happened to have my... it right there with them. <laughs> I do. I just, I just, re Art's reading my mind. I, it's, this is one of my favorite walk tools. It's a, it's a little ladle that I cook with. And oh, did you finish the handle for that? Yeah, it, 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 it had a, a bamboo handle on it, and you can see the split right there. The split. Yep. It, yeah, it had been run through the dishwasher a number of times, in spite of us telling everybody don't put wood, wood anything with wood in it in the dishwasher. Uh, so I used a piece of Texas ebony, and I, I made a new handle for it. Uh, Greg. Greg asked, are you doing your own live now that you have good internet? I'm working on the courage, but I also need to figure out uh, how to it's change the camera angles with all. They're not yes. seeing it's just me opening and closing room. If, if they run that through the dishwasher, heads are going to roll. Kick their ass. Kick your ass. Billy, that looks more like a cereal spoon. Yeah. like my cereal spoon. <laughs> I haven't had cereal in forever. I've also become lactose intolerant. But no, uh, Bino. Hopefully, eventually, Greg. <laughs> Cliff, I'm intolerant of lacking toes too. That's why I still have all of mine. Me too, I think. I've never understood how some people can go barefoot. I can't. I every little thing I step on hurts. Tenderfoot. Jeannie says pretty, oh, yeah. and so did I Jenny love. Andy. Thank you, ladies. I, I love stepping on Legos and shit. <laughs> if I ever do, I'm wondering where my dog's got the Lego set. <clears throat> well, I, I know where the, they come from. They come from the toy room right up back over yonder, from my grand, my my, my young grandchildren and my great grandchildren. Hey, when I back when I last time I touched Lego, there wasn't even sets. They were just a bunch of Legos. <laughs> yeah, you'd, 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 you'd buy like a variety box that had like 80,000 80, pieces in it, right? Yeah. Thought it was quite that many, but yeah. And he said she used to put cigarettes out with her bare feet when she was young. Ah. <sighs> Why don't you just say you're tougher than you? Do all men love cereal? I used, I'll tell you, even the cereals I loved as a kid aren't as sweet and stuff now. Like Golden Grams, I used to get to eat a box of those dry, and they're barely even Golden. sweet anymore. Golden Grams, like eating sugar smacks. I... <laughs> See, in, 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 the house, sugar smacks. in the house right now, I have a box of Alphabets, Honeycomb, uh, Reese Puffs, and frosted, uh, fr uh, sugar frosted flakes. I, I eat two kinds of cereal, I don't know, maybe three times over six months. Uh, Carrie has honey nut, honey nut Cheerios and uh, Captain Crunch. That's pretty much all I eat. See, Honey Nut Cheerios isn't as good as it used to. When I was eating my breakfast, I could find every once in a while a Cheerio would literally have honey blocking the hole. And now that's they just dumbed everything down for the yeah. See, like like I, I have to have like alphabets the honeycomb at least or uh, alphabets or or Lucky Charms at least once a week. I don't know why. Just got to keep my sugar. <laughs> and when I ever I had Lucky Charms, I only wanted the the marshmallow parts. No, it's for the toy. It's for the toy in the box. Yeah, I loved honeycomb as a kid too, Jeannie. I'm still working on frosted flakes. What? And every time I've been blocking the hole? <laughs> they, they call it a honey pot for a reason, just saying. And he said, started out as a bet. She won $100 and then used it to make money, built up callus on her heel. <coughs> so you were using your body to make money. <laughs> uh, I'm not touching that one. <laughs> I'm not even. No, nope. he are on her body. Not 20 bad. bucks, 20 bucks. Wouldn't be <laughs> when you're 18, you gotta learn how to survive on the streets, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, was that out loud? I, I, I didn't mean for that to be out loud. Sorry, 
the honey was blocking her hole, man. I never thought about it that way, Cliff. <laughs> <laughs> way to ruin it, Cliff. I sold my kidneys. I was selling my body. If I've gone long enough or too long, I'm totally awful. And you've raised it, I mean. So you said anyone cereal. remember Quisp cereal? I've never or heard of it. Too old. I've never heard of it either. So I, and I'm, I know I'm older than you. <laughs> what? And he what said cereal? if those dumb boys were dumb enough to give me money for it, oh well. Yeah. What? What cereal? True that, Annie. Quisp. Quisp. Never, never heard, heard of it. it. Well, it was Susie, very quisp. Come on, how old are you? How old are you, Susie? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> super sugar crisp. <laughs> I'm so old. I remember Ovaltine. I do too. I've heard of Ovaltine. You know what? You know what? I actually do remember that. I remember the commercial. Come on, Billy. You got to. You got. You got to remember that. Crisp? No. Nope. Really? Even I remember nope. that. We had it Made in by Illinois. Quaker. Yeah, I don't know. I don't Quisp? remember it. Uh, it almost looks like Special K. And he said she still drinks Ovaltine. She's 65, Susie is. What? Hostess, hostess Twinkies? Look at the Hostess Twinkie cereal. Oh, my God. No. That sounds good for you. Greg says, I, hate I know women that anyway. trim their calluses on their feet with 80 grit sanding dish on a die grinder. Look at the commercial. Uh, Susie too. said she's 65. Well, I don't remember Quisp. I'm 68, almost. Um, what was that, Art? I said uh, that Quisp cereal. I, I know they sold it where I lived in Illinois. Okay, so I, I, I don't remember ever seeing it. It was introduced in 65 and then uh, continued as a mass market grocery item until the late 70s. Uh, subsequently, the Quaker Oats Company marketed Quisp sporadically and with the advent of the internet, began selling it primarily online. And then it became back in the supermarkets in the late 2012. I don't remember ever seeing it in my life. Me either. Yep, it's been around for 59 years. I may have so, had oval team, but I don't know. No, Greg, I'm 68. I'll be 69 now, in July. Uh, Gary, uh, <coughs> I was so born in July. Who out there? Who out there besides? I, I don't even know, Greg. Greg, I don't even know if you might have had it. Have you ever eaten Sunny Boy? Uh, oh, thank you not to bring him up. We had a bad fight. Only the cereal I ever liked. <laughs> I actually used to like Sunny Boy. Uh, yeah, well, um, I actually got home from the movie. Uh, <sighs> Caleb said he didn't want to keep the cash anymore. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Greg has eaten it. <clears throat> I guess so. Made, made in Alberta. Yeah. What? No way. Yep, it's, 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 it's almost like cream of wheat, but it was made, it was made in Alberta. For or like oil field guys, right? And 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 then they start mass marketing it. It's like it's like problem. Almost like cream of wheat. That, that's multi meal. Yeah. yeah. God, I hadn't had any of those in so long. I used to like grape nuts. Oh, me too. I like these I love that. But nobody told me the first time I had that that it swells up in milk. So yeah. I had like 16 bowls worth in one bowl. <laughs> yeah, <coughs> folks, we, uh, freaking uh, super sugar crisp. Mm -hmm. I remember, Billy, the first time I ate grape nuts, I filled the whole bowl almost. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it took me hours to eat. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was just saying. Like, like told me to send the pictures. Yeah. Hey, like, Jack, yours is finished. You, you remember who used to do the Great Nuts commercial? No, not, uh, not, not, not you, would have if you, you had now. Yule Gibson. Yule Gibbons. He was a naturalist. And my name is Yule Gibbons. I don't remember that. You ever tried eating Great Nuts? Taste reminds me of wild hickory nuts. 
<laughs> I really like this color combination. I'm glad you came up with it. Why didn't you? Because I'm all, I thought I was perfect, but I was mistaken. Wait, let's look, I've done, see it I've again. done one similar with purple. Um, see it? Get it straight and, there. And I never like well, Yes, I'm surprised you didn't go with like yellow and blue and white. You know. Yeah, I, I was a little surprised that there wasn't going to be yellow in there, but she locked the copper. And uh, she she based it on this one that I showed her. Sorry. She said change it to. Sorry, St. Louis. Yeah, it's funny. Thank you, Joe. Joe says, that's pretty. That's pretty. And it's exactly six and a quarter. Oh, y'all got some small recesses. I still can't believe Connie said her was five or something. <clears throat> Whoever said it so wasn't going to get another one. What? That's awesome. Threatened me with a good time. Uh, the shot, uh, blah, uh, China has left the DL. Well, you know, you better order a second bracer from him before you order one sign from me. That's just the way it works on John's show. <laughs> <laughs> I can't com <coughs> I completely get what you mean. Okay, China's is red, black, and gray, so I can't use none of these colors. That's called friendship tax. <laughs> <laughs> well, for what it's worth with Jack, as I'm trading, not, not, it's not just a, what's it called, an order or a gift. So you're making her, like, four more bracelets in for the cost of her peanut? Yeah, I kind of tripped out that she considered that a trade. I don't know how much she ch charges for peanuts. Wait, 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 wait. What, what are you saying, Jess? <laughs> I'd never get a finished sign, John. <laughs> She's acting like longer. she knows you or something, man. That's rude. <laughs> the hell is that supposed to be? <laughs> That's how you can't ask that without a, with a straight hey, voice. <laughs> just watch, how long, it takes me, just watch how long it takes me to finish this one for Crafty Annie. It used to take me two days to finish a bracelet when I first started. I am a Lord of the Rings. That's what they shall say from now on. At least in front of me. Or it used to take me eight hours to start doing a sign. <laughs> now I can get one started. Uh, and, uh, I can picture uh, her cracking up right now in the background there. Who is that girl? Cassie. That girl. Who's Cassie? Jessica, Who's that girl? Jessica, Jessica said Nancy's done. <laughs> it's, it's really out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. She's, she's blushing and chuckling over there, I guarantee it. Is Nancy's hey. done? Hey, that one's like, <laughs> that's like my, my, my elite freaking, that's like my swan song. <laughs> that one has to be like perfect. <laughs> yeah, yours just has to be mediocre, silly buns. Uh, if you ordered a sign from me, Jess, you'd get a finished <laughs> Oh, snappity doo -dah. Get it. Wait, wait, she, she'd get it what? <clears throat> a finished one. <laughs> you notice how I'm not saying nothing, John. I'm not stupid. I value my penal placement. <laughs> I love my friends that know me all so well. John's project is like fine wine and good cheese. They take time to... <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> sure. That's funny right you guys are lucky yeah. I could take a joke, man. Actually, you know, I, I did bring it on myself. It is my own hashtag. This is true. They got you oh, wait, one. wait. What is it you asked? Oh, it's hashtag unfinished scroll spot projects. Yeah. yeah I'm so sorry and since I'm the only one that's ever used it, if you go over there, all you'll find is what if I could. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ain't a whole lot of people using it, is there? Nobody else has ever thought to use that for their hashtag. Yeah, believe it or not. Yeah, it's a marketing ploy. You people don't even get it. <laughs> God dang it. Greg, it's more like we'll take time to finish. Well, I could start the hell out of it. <laughs> I 
So never ask John how how long will it take you to start this project? No, 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 no. There's a difference. Oh, that's that's not the question. He starts them quick. Yeah, that's what Yo. I'm saying. Don't ever ask it that way. Show me the me. <laughs> Show me the what? <coughs> Show me the money. Show me the money. That was a good move. No, no, no. No, no, no. <laughs> Say it like you mean it. Show me the money. Show me the money. That's another actor we may never see in a movie again. Cuba Gooding Jr. Who? Oh, Cuba Gooding Jr. Wow. I, I, like, I, I like him. He got a, a cute of forced stuff. I don't think it was downright R word, really? but... I mean, it's, that's actually kind of old news now. Huh. Don't be flashing your bills on the screen there, Jess. Billy, Billy finishes his projects yeah. after he sends them around the shop a couple times. <laughs> hey, Greg. Not, not always, Greg. Sometimes they stay put. Yeah, exactly, Chris. Like, like Nancy's portrait is, is my opus. It's, it's my swan song, as I'm saying. It's like my, my ultimate creation so far. Now, the next one, you know, what if, if I put some more thought into the next one, it might even be like, Better than Nancy's. What? what I'm saying. You're yeah. saying it may turn out better than the real thing. No, no, no. What I'm saying no, is, I'm just is, is with you. <laughs> if I do one on the same caliber as, as Nancy and Earl's portrait, it may be better than Nancy and Earl's portrait. I'm just saying, you never know. That's you, know how right. mind, you know how my mind works, right? Like I might, you know, make like a an infinity infinity mirror box behind it. With LEDs, and fuck, that, that way it looks like it would look like it's floating in the freaking middle of space, right? Like, yeah. Yes, Jenny, I'm smoking again. I'm celebrating the finish of one in the. I've always the wanted to do an infinity. Right. I've always wanted to do an infinity box too. So, somebody's gonna be a lucky person. <clears throat> For the low, low price of you know, whatever it costs. More than you got. Yeah, whatever it costs. Hey, Nancy. Hey, Connie. Uh, John says, here's my video link for tomorrow. Still uploading. Perfect, Connie. Appreciate that. Cool. And sometimes Billy signs his work in blood. Yeah, we know that too. Sometimes. <laughs> sometimes. When somebody, when you're using these really thick and hard rings, I, I know, John, uh, you have to use a lot of pressure and everything, and they often sacrificed to the gods some blood <laughs> so if i ever get into stainless steel and all that stuff i shall give my blood to the cause we are almost ready yay 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 yeah. I gotta fill up the dog's water. I am Carson. the other meeting with Lucy. Here. Uh huh. You must be the inspector from the insurance company. I'm Lou. You're Lou. Yeah, it's short for Louise. I'm gonna call you that then. You have an uncle Lou and you is nothing like him. We just recently went to the crime loft and we want to have it added to the existing. Let's scope it out. Amy, would you mind taking Carson up to the barn? Oh, I'm sorry, but I actually have a client arriving in a minute. I can't. And we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye, Bye Bobby. Bye, 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 that really the thing when I say uh, hi daddy or something like that, that's about all I can say. Because I end up choking on my quote. Or you can tell I'm squeezing my throat, whatever. I'm gonna squeeze your throat in a minute. Yeah, like, like how you now hates being touched, eh? But like, like, so so back when he was doing his comedy show, it was his, his prop show and everything else, it, it, it was a cool show. It, and 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 like, like the reason he shaved his head too is because his hair started bothering him. And he, 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 started, he started getting a phobia. He, he was getting a phobia from his hair. That's why he shaved his head. Huh. And then he, like, he can now, pull it off too. Yeah, and, and now he hates me. Like, like anybody that goes to shake, he hates shaking hands. Like he has a phobia yeah, about shaking hands or, or, or being touched or being held. Like 
almost like an autism it's, twitch, it's right? Germ, germ, he's got germaphobia. Yeah, he's yeah. a germaphobe. Yeah. Hey. He can pull off being bald. I can't. I don't know. I go look stupid being bald. I could when I was younger, but once my vitiligo spread to my head, I look like a burnt cancer patient. So I can't pull yeah, it off no more. I've, I've, I've never tried being bald. I just can't see myself uh, going bald. I, I was actually told you got a good head shape for that, and now, no, I'm, hell no. Yeah. Oh, I forgot. Got forgot. Um, Gary bought me a new God only, God only made a few perfect heads. The rest of me covered with hair. Uh, when Carrie bought my yarn for me, uh, she bought me a pig too. I'll, I'll bring it up tomorrow in my shop. I cut my hair damn near to bald, but not quite. Hey, Larry. Hello, Larry. <clears throat> hey, for the record, I haven't started my cigarette yet. I was making coffee. Welcome back, Mr. Aldrich. So don't you got you got a Tassimo or what do you got? Gary? Uh, who? What was that? You have a Tassimo or a Keurig or something, or is it like a coffee pot? Oh, it's a Keurig, yeah. But I make my own pods. It's, no, like so it's not a little pot. It's not real coffee. Yeah. Why don't no, you get a real coffee as... pot? No, why don't you get a real coffee pot? Oh. And make like a full pot. Well, I'll tell you exactly why. That's actually a good question. The reason why yeah. is because I drink coffee all day and all night, and they won't stay on forever, so you have to turn them back on. When you do, they want to brew, <laughs> and so you end up burning burning out the part that does the brewing. All day, all night, Mary Ann. Okay, so you know, I, I prefer it you, that way. Okay, so why don't you get a coffee pot and a craft? Your craft will keep your coffee pot or the thermos. That way you can make your coffee, pour it in a thermos, my thermos stays hot all day long. Very I'll tell point. you one, the best coffee maker I've ever owned was a, a bun coffee maker, and it had a tank in the back that stayed hot, so it was, always was ready, and it took like uh, 30 seconds to make a cup of coffee, if that. Like one of the, like one of the industrial ones? As yeah. diners? Well, yeah. not quite. It, it's the same brand, but... Uh, it doesn't have multiple things. It just has, uh, you Easy. fill up one tank and then the one that's already been in there will be hot. It was so Easy. cool, but it finally, finally kicked the bucket. I literally had it on 24 hours a day from 2012 until 2019. So that, it was 120 bucks back then. It's probably a lot more now. Find somebody who actually wanted to. But I'd prefer to make my coffee like that. But if you leave it on long enough, it starts looking like motor oil. Oh, yeah, so I'm just going to get back to the house. You're, you're okay here? What are you talking about, Greg? Okay. What song is that? <clears throat> All right. Yeah, good. We're just talking. Greg said, who the hell do you think I am, Superman? <laughs> <coughs> I still haven't actually started the smoking part. <laughs> I just got to make more damn signs. I keep talking about it. I'm not doing it. I got that song stuck in my head. Thanks, Cliff. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> All day. Which Superman song? There's like three of them. There we go. Oh. Down by the seaside, sifting sand. I don't even know that song. <laughs> uh, it's an old one. If I'd have known it, I might have done it on purpose, but I didn't. I, I do it to myself as often as anybody else. Why aren't you using the proper red when, when I was born, uh, Wasted Days and Wasted Nights was playing. Freddy Fender. I, you remember that? How do you remember that? Did they pipe that into the, the maternity ward? <laughs> Not Connie. Not Connie. Uh, uh, oh, Connie, Connie, I need to ask you, how's your husband doing? Is he better tonight? Were you here when she gave the announcement? <laughs> tonight? Yeah. No. Yeah, she said... Uh, I'm sure she's going to repeat it anyway. 
uh, he was basically uh, dehydrated. Oh, okay. No, I wasn't here. I, I don't think I was here for that. I, I knew when she had to go check on her husband. I missed everything no. after that. Uh, but yeah, Annie, Annie said you need to make more of the steam comes from the gears in the head saying just BRB, just thinking. I do want to think of a bunch of different clever ones. Or at least my version of clever. Yeah. <laughs> or an empty skull. <laughs> With a burnt out light bulb on it. I just thought of another one. BRB making another <laughs> sign. Or this this sign intentionally left blank. <laughs> figured, figured out what I'm doing. Insert phrase here. Yeah. <laughs> This that one says insert phrase here. I may waste a lot of paper and toner. <laughs> did, did you see Annie's comment? The one about the gears in the head I saw. Not, not, oh, yeah. Okay. Like night. Never mind. <clears throat> yeah, you overdid everything yesterday. Yeah. Okay, good. But I wouldn't necessarily have to walk away to think. I, I hate it when I do that. Don't walk away, Eileen. Come on, Eileen. And her friend, too. What do you mean? I mean, you might be good at a lot of things, but hiding your feelings? Not well, not really. All you're complaining about the trailer, not having a home, pretty obvious what it's all about. You're not so good at hiding what you're thinking either. Gotcha. That would be. That nearly sounded like Tom Hanks. I never even considered that. Yeah. Really? really? No, it's the one line he did. No, what? he never did. Okay. Never even considered that. What? No. I'm Fading, so. so lost right now. Oh, you're reading, you're listening to the movie. Okay. Now we can read it. Bit of love. The love without you. You're stuck out there, so you should be hearing from Air supply. Yeah, don't nice. walk away, okay. Renee. That was it. Thank you. Carson, um, you ought to see the, the guy with the high pitched voice from Air Supply. You ought to see him now. He looks like a grandmother. I was thinking he looked about James more James feminine James. than he did then. Advice. I didn't know that was possible. Yeah. yeah. Great. Maybe we could. He literally looks this. like an old woman, like a tomboy oh. old woman, but he looks like an old woman. Uh, yeah, I was. Tomorrow afternoon. Yeah, they're still kicking. I can do that. Do you want to meet at Maggie's in town? Sure. Okay. Let's meet at Maggie's. Oh, let's go down to Molly's Reach. I'm just getting some juice for Katie. <laughs> All I was doing, you don't have to explain Why, to me. Why? Oh, no. That's a <clears throat> now I got that one stuck in my head, Greg. Thanks. Oh, <laughs> Okay, I've got two dogs. God dang it. Come on, but do <sighs> He's not trapped in the garage again. For casual coffee and a diner that you want. How much are you going to get? There are times I wish my head wasn't quite so musical. <laughs> there you go, Amy. Mine, mine can be played just right with enough wind. Cool. No, I'd like Let's to get John. I'm looking at Annie. Cool. Look at his monster arms with blue monster fur. See? Yeah. And then Super Grover is going to go right on top of it. Oh, it's going to be so cool. I love Super yeah. Grover. Yeah. I love yeah. Grover overall. Sorry, I didn't call first, but I was looking at another. I've never seen Grover in overall. That's okay. Grover. Farmer Grover. 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 Oh, oh, yeah. Uh, back when he was with. Uh, uh, when he was with Forgetful Jones' uh, niece, what was her name? Uh, Clementine. Yeah. yeah I'm your site. Bear seems to be perfect for your program. Well, he's a good height. Nice color. He was just a good farmer. Yeah, my husband's a vet. <clears throat> Actually, Bear saved his life this a lot. going to look cool. Yeah, we were on this really steep trail, and Ty fell over a ledge. I tied a rope around Bear's saddle, and he pulled us back to safety. He never flinched. He just stayed calm and did exactly what I asked of him. She sounds like she's reading her lines. If I come by tomorrow, can we get some more for Baron and Penn? Sure. Yeah, so it's some time. See that, Billy? I have a good feeling. Cool. 
as Grover and overalls. Groveralls. Yeah. Ask and you shall see. I, I mean, Groveralls. Yeah, Barbara Grover reporting for duty. <laughs> oh, I only had four rings open out of all those bastards. <laughs> There he is. That's the Grover I had. <laughs> he was huge. I'm telling you, he was like, he was like, four, he was like, like four, three, four feet tall. Huge. Amy said uh, Stephen came by earlier. It's nice to see you again. Yeah, we're going to play. Are you? Twelve. Look at these. Sorry, I don't know. Sorry. No, I mean, look how big he is. My look son had one like that John down. had picked up half the bed. Right? <laughs> Lord. Stupid label that people put on spending time with someone that doesn't <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was a Pillsbury <laughs> Doughboy. You know what? Here's what you're the do. one thing I still remember from freaking Sesame yeah. Street was uh, uh, for Apple Jones trying to sing Oklahoma. Coffee. He kept forgetting the line. Arrive. It was <laughs> terrible to eat. eat. Oklahoma. No, no forgetful Jones. It's Oklahoma. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I Oklahoma. No, no, no forgetful Jones. It's Oklahoma. Oh, I don't okay. remember that character. You Oklahoma. No, no, no forgetful Jones. It's Oklahoma. Oh. You went through the entire alphabet, right? Yeah. I thought he was just going through the vowels. <laughs> yeah, the vowels. Of the, the vowels of the alphabet. Yeah. Never mind. You know what I mean. Annie says he has this old blue dog like stuffy that he's had since he was three. I have sewn that thing up so many times I can't even remember the original color except he called him blue thing. <laughs> uh, we're, digging after, we're digging through stuff after my, my dad passed away and uh, I found my, my apparently there was a, a two rabbits that I slept with when I was baby that I got on uh, my birthday. And I still had them, and they were like so worn through. Like all the fuzz was almost all the way off of them. Blue thing, you make my heart sing. <laughs> you make everything blue. There we go. Now I get another one in my head. <laughs> well, let's get some hair band song caught in your head then. I <laughs> I'll come back in a couple days. What comes around goes around. You don't tell me why. Yeah. Wait, wait. I'm singing rat. Were you, were you singing? Yeah, were you singing that's what one? I was saying. Nope, I was doing rat. <laughs> home sweet home. Oh. Oh. Hell is that song is always blasted. Which song? Three. Round and round? <laughs> Thank me singing home sweet home. What was, what was the album? Out of the attic or something like that? Uh, into the cellar. <laughs> Close. <laughs> yeah, toys in oh, the uh, attic. Aerosmith. It wasn't that far off. <laughs> Just the other oh, other yeah. end of the house. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know. I don't know. See, cause it, I, I also remember a band called Dangerous. I remember a band, a band called Dangerous Toys. Pleasing, pleasing, yeah. had a freaking evil, evil, evil Jack in the Box on their freaking album cover. Yeah, I think I'm in the wrong house. They were from Austin, Texas, I believe. As a matter of fact, I believe. Which you, I don't think you'd recognize the name, but there's a country singer, Kevin Fowler. I think he was a bassist for that band. Or something similar. Connie, what I always blast, no matter where I am, is money for nothing. You know, song, I like, <laughs> the one song I will blare in the freaking truck, no matter where I am, is Coming to America. I don't know why. It's, it's just freaking, it just gets me every time. Neil Diamond. Yep. I got to blare it, like blast. I roll down all my windows and I just blare it. The bass is just. Boo, boo, boo. The window's just shaking. I don't care. There's an Ozzy Concrete. Osbourne song that's good to test your bass, and that's Mom, I'm Coming Home. Bass, bass, bass. Man of the bone. To say. Uh, usually if I blare something, it's either jamming heavy metal or it's uh, 
a country song that I love singing at the top. I know of the horses always have a purpose, but they also need companionship. I'm sure Marilyn will be friends with these horses. Going for coffee and donuts. <laughs> and Accuse me. Thank you. Not most fun Accuse you of right what? Now. Anything that's not necessarily illegal. Lord, there's another flawed ring. <laughs> At least I'm catching them before they get wet. Well, what do you what do you expect? They're from China. <laughs> <laughs> what these rings? No, they're actually from Minnesota. Oh, that's where they were imported. The ones that come from China, yeah. uh, they're they're so soft you can't even work with them. Bad the bone. <clears throat> and it's a shame too, because Shay bought me a ton of gorgeous colors and stuff, but they were. It turns out it was a frequently returned item. So I felt so bad for her. The only time I can blast metal is when I'm home alone and I haven't been alone since 2003, literally. I didn't know you listen to metal. That's, that's, that's so metal. I love me metal and I love me country. It's kind of weird. And I love me hair bands. The rest of it is depends on what it is. Art Lex metal. Yep. <laughs> it still trips me out that Don Yarndall listens to Slayer. <laughs> Nothing, I just, she doesn't strike me as a type. That was a pleasant surprise. Crafty Annie says, I love all music, but my son got me into metal when he was in high school. I turned him onto the rat pack. <laughs> oh, you want to hear something? Well, it's it's funny to me. But I was my dad finally let us put up posters and I took him one to show him and said, God, that's a motley looking crew. And it was Motley Crew. I shit you not. <laughs> yeah. the, 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 the chances of him using those words. Well that was crazy. I wish that would have been on video. Cause <laughs> I had never heard him use those words in my life. But yeah, I uh, I used to listen to country alone. Then uh, my sister sister introduced me to Van Halen one, and then I got the Rat and Motley Crew. The first metal I listened to was Metallica and Pantera. She was. First metal I listened to was Dawkins. You might, you guys might pronounce it Dokin down there though. No, no, Dokin. Well, Dokin. Yeah, his name is Don Dokin. <laughs> no, no, you guys might add an extra vowel on or drop a vowel somewhere. No. I don't, yeah, Andy, I don't like the older country. Uh, I've seen him twice. The first time he was the opening act for a bunch of groups that opened before Poison. One of those was Cinderella. And he was, eh, you know, so so. And this is who? Time. Dockin, Don Dockin. Oh yeah. And then, I, and then I saw him open for White Snake, who opened for the Scorpions, and he he rocked the house, dude. And then and White Snake just tore the roof off, and the Scorpions came on, and it was very anti. Did he rock you like a hurricane? <clears throat> no, the. The, the the lead singer got up and sang and walked around a little bit and the guys played. It sounded just like they did on the radio. It was, it was good music. <clears throat> but they didn't interact with the crowd. Uh, LC is with us. It was just very anticlimactic. It was so ho hum. Wow. Uh, Any the seventies and I like some seventies music, but as far as Rock and country, it would have to be 80s and 90s. And then, then it's pick and choose from there. Uh, like, I personally, I don't think uh, Hank Williams Sr. could sing all that well. I think he was the best of the singers back then. And I just never got into classic rock. <laughs> you didn't like, you don't like Hank Sr.? 
you cannot call yourself a country know. music fan. I don't have a very good uh huh. No, you can't. I'll do what I want. <laughs> Not allowed. Respect my authority. I'm getting older. I don't want to be longer. I love her. John, should I look at that now? What you sent? You can. Okay, I'll I'll use that as an excuse to have a cigarette. Saw Hank Jr. in concert. God, that was disappointing. <laughs> I think he's his own biggest fan. Oh, God, it sucked. Yeah, Black Sabbath I didn't get into, but I, I was exposed to it. I, would, they, I didn't really consider them metal. They were just hard rock. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't get into Leonard Skitter and it all of them. It's not her. It's the There's horse. a tear in my bear because I'm crying for you, dear. Don't like disco, punk, <laughs> rap, not much for metal, hair metal. That's uh, uh, Mr. Greg. And Annie says, I always hated it when my parents told me to turn my music down so I told my kids if dad's not home, rock out. Hi. If it's too loud, you're too old. Let me finish opening up the red rings. My mother used to tell me that my rock music gave her a headache. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I tried to show some to my dad. He said, they're having to yell over the music. I said, metal mainly is the music. The, the words are just basically a story to go with it. I always told him uh, metal is basically fuck the world music. Especially heavy metal. I feel like I haven't made enough of that in my life. Well, sometimes we get back. I have no idea. And I kind of doubt you do either. You want to hear another shocker? I've never sat and watched the show yet. I like that much. It never struck me as interesting. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow, for dinner, right here. Hey, Billy, I did like hey, that. I have a night wish. The what? Night wish. That's true, Billy. Just Missy, this is with us. Yeah, that was, that was pretty cool. Good talk, Missy. You know the singer, Flo? The who? The singer of, of the band? Yeah. You know she had uh, breast cancer? Yeah. No. Scott gave me a tetanus shot. I think she's uh, whooped it. I'm not sure. I hope. I'm trying to remember what I said, Annie. Uh, uh, Art, uh, Annie would like to know if you ever stained your puzzles. What were you no. thinking? Well, you no, Annie, yeah, I don't stain them. Oh, my God. Look at this, people. Look at the sandwich. 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 I, I think I said I never listened to something. Oh, know. they're coasters! No freaking way! Oh, you have no idea how this is going to affect you, buddy. Harry. Oh, Mishi, here's them for you. <laughs> Herb's going to go get in the recliner. Spent too long at his desk. Take care, Herb. All right, Herbie, have a good one. Okay, now I smoke for you. I'm gonna go down the hall. For you, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> hey, that song's gonna be stuck in the head now. I'll be back. I gotta go that's down the hall for a second. Okay, that's one of my favorite Christmas songs, though. Is <laughs> the Mr. Drummer Boy. Okay, they ought to be in such. Moving away. Minutable. For good. Oh. Here I was all nervous, but it means to have a boy. Oh, look at this. So this crocheter takes her pieces and then dips them in porcelain slip and fires them. It feels like a right now. It's just... You know, I'm trying to put some positive spin on this because I'm not even... You're like, what? No way. Yeah. 
porcelain. Yeah. Jerry, 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 that's the next thing you're doing, man. You're going to get a kiln, and you're going to take your crochet works and dip them in porcelain and turn them into art. Hi, Joey. Me in the better than 3D printing. Just <laughs> saying. Don't worry, Grandpa. It was awesome. Not hard to catch me in a cigarette break, but hey. Oh, that's heartbreaking. So I hope you had a little more luck than that on your date yesterday. You went on a date. Hello? Yes, this is she. Oh, yeah, thank you for getting back to me. Uh, what? Huh. No, no, there must be some mistake. See, it doesn't take me long to finish to do it, start a project. No. Yeah, you got a lot done today. Thank you. It's just finishing a project. It takes a while. <laughs> <laughs> what? That was the insurance company. They got Carson's report, and the loft failed his inspection. I wonder if I should keep this together before I cut it all out. Yeah, I think I will. It was coffee, and when it turned out a real date, when it filed a bogus report, was that even possible? He's seeing the lock is not Not after gold. We did everything by the book. Of course we did. We're not going to let him get away with this. I think you should reconsider that. And I'll be going with you too. Uh, Art says, Annie, I dip my puzzles in oil, but if someone wants to paint them, I'll send them Oh, yeah. You could have, you could have answered that, Art. Did I interrupt you with my, with my crocheting stuff? I'm all excited with your crochet. Ah, no. It, 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 Mishi came in. I had to show Mishi something. <laughs> you can play Mishi oh, for that. Hello, Joe. <laughs> I know, Joe, I, know Jerry. I know how to fight, Joe. Jerry said hi, Joe, and I said hello, Joe. Dumbass. What's going on, Jerry? Hello, Jerry. Dumbass. Hello, Mishi. <laughs> oh, that's uh, Mishi. That's uh, <laughs> Billy's wife is watching Heartland on Netflix. Oh, sorry. No, she just asked me, what, what are we listening to? <laughs> oh. I should have muted when I got up. My bad. We forgive thee. Okay, Annie. If you ever want one, just let me know how you want it done. You Jerry, want to the <laughs> <up on>. <laughs> <laughs> Jerry says he's watched several shows via Billy. <laughs> yes, he has. I was wondering if he was going to get we a chance to talk that. before the show was over. After saying Actually, hello. Jerry has watched quite a few shows or listened to quite a few shows via me. The best part is when Billy falls asleep. Some of them he got so interested in he watched himself. <laughs> <laughs> Rejection is pathetic, okay? Because my dad and my grandpa take great pride in their work. They do. Uh, no, actually, wasn't. Right. They tied new wire in the existing electrical wall. Don't try to snow me with technical jargon, okay? Even though they're technical, just even install new breaker boxes. Art, you've got a message in the chat. So what? Yeah. Do I take now? Really, no. dog and person. <laughs> I think he's talking about that the guy that's bent over putting his dog and it's a two piece scroll. It's kind of a stick figurey thing. Oh, I have some of those. Yeah, down, you're, you're, you're a little human, Jeff. Yeah, yeah I, I got one on the paper and it's. Uh, I got hey, one. Hey, Neil and. It actually holds, it holds a pencil. Like he's mm. throwing a spear, but it, it holds just a pencil. Yeah, it's one of those kind of figures. I don't I don't have the whole book done yet, Jerry. I'm not happy with it. He said, yeah, he bought the patterns, but never did them. <coughs> Hello, I, Steve. I think I got about 10 done, Jerry. I heard from Scott. And the budget buster has something called pushing his lines. It's probably not as cute as... Ta -da. If I didn't say hi earlier. 
That's what's happening. I, don't, I, I got a pencil somewhere. Yeah, I'm onion again. <laughs> Hi, onion. That doesn't sound good. Actually, that's because I bring tears to people's eyes when I show up on a live. Mm. This is what it's here in my beer, and I'm crying for you, dear. I'm so sorry. Yeah, you were on my lawn, I just can't see my yeah. hair Looks like you're throwing a javelin. Yeah, that's what it's supposed to look like. <clears throat> cool. Jerry said, I need the one with the guy and the dog. I'll buy one. Uh, but which guy and which dog? Hello, Crystal. Send me a picture, Jerry. I'll see if I got that one done. Hey, 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 I'm walking back and forth from from the door every time I see the chat move. <laughs> Jerry, you should be able to design that yourself. They're simple. <laughs> yeah, they are simple. And he will fragile. send a pic. And what? Fragile, too. No. They don't look as tough as they are. Pretty frenzy. Yeah. Hello, Crystal. That's Moonrose, right? Yeah. yeah. Crystal, Je uh, Jessica Crystal said check your email in case you're not reading. Oh, uh, well. <clears throat> That's where there's several small hawks in here. There's one of those that looks like a wasp. Hello, Robin. Hello, Robin. I haven't even seen it. I was trying to, if I can catch one of these, Billy, I'll show you what I was talking about the other night. <laughs> he said, he, Billy, he said, uh, the man bending over to pet the dog, right? I'm guessing that's the one he wants. <clears throat> uh, I, did, I did a couple a dog and a man and a dog with a woman. I'd have to look in the box. Oh, Mishi, you're going to get it all teary-eyed. Why'd you bring that up? Jeez, Mishi. <laughs> I'm kidding. Actually, I'm kind of relieved because I don't have to give up my lunch and stuff. Is Jerry still here? Jerry, are you still yep. here? Uh, sent in messenger art. Because he sent right, to you well, a messenger. I got this. I got this one. Is this is this the one you're talking about, Jerry? But I'll look in messenger real quick. That's that's the one I was talking about that I thought he might be talking about. Twenty five bucks plus shipping. Yeah, that's the one he wants. Oh, oh. <clears throat> do you that's want the me pattern. to do anything with it or just sand it and send it? That's the pattern he wants. I think he wants the pattern. Oh, he want. Oh, you want the pattern? Are you so mad? I'm just glad that my horse is going to be okay. Get up by the whole man. I guess your mom is pretty mad. <coughs> no. Oh. He, he has an No. No. Oh, okay. I'll send you the. I'll send you the pattern. Uh, what? Really? He said, no, I need to cut it. For your sake, I know. Oh, okay. Well, heck, it's already done. <laughs> well, I just go. Thank you, Adele. You don't have to cut it. I'll just give you this one. Hey, a bunch of girls are going to go hang out at Maggie's later. It's like no big deal, but you could come too. Oh, uh, let's see. Where are they? <laughs> yeah, maybe. Oh. I gotta find her. Uh oh, he said no. I need to cut it. Remember, I sold my scroll saws. Uh, uh, I'm not the one that claims to be some kind of expert. Well, I'll make it for you. Here, it's already done. I didn't know you scrolled. So how are you gonna cut it? 
Oh, LOL, I need someone to make it for me. Oh, he wants you. Okay. So y'all work out a deal. <laughs> I'll get with you, Jerry. I could have made I could have made you one, Jerry. Who'd we lose? Um uh nobody. Everybody's here. Everybody's here. Jerry's looking at that. Oh, oh I, never mind. I, I got you. I see it. And it wasn't quite about that. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, way back. Uh, it wasn't funny. It wasn't oh. oh, yeah, remember I sold my scrolls off. Cost 30 bucks to ship from Canada. Chris Neelan's here. We got two Neelan's. Hello, Chris. Hello, Chris. Oh, Lord. <laughs> So you're going to bed, Chris. What are you doing up so late? <laughs> yeah, I you, you got to go spend time with the grandkids. He snuck out. He's a rebel. I promise. <laughs> Annie's about to leave us. Why don't you just come out and say you hate us? Well, my friends, it's midnight. What? House call 100 miles away. Uh, uh, what? Damn. Denise made her first successful yarn cake video dedicated to the maker's crochet items and woodshed theory. Oh, cool. Beth! <laughs> I know I'm late, so no need to scroll. <laughs> Just scold me. Oh, you've been up since 4 a.m. You may go. I will allow it. Beth. I tried calling you, but it's been it's it's so late, and the guys just want to play, so I don't know what to do. Yeah, yeah, Cliff, yeah, yeah. Huh? 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 Yeah. Did you get it? There you are, Beth. Hey, John Art, Billy, and Chip. And now I'm Chip, Kip and Chip. <laughs> I love it. It's freaking ridiculous. No, you're you know what's freaking ridiculous is the freaking taxes you guys charge coming across the freaking border. Yeah. Bullshit. Yes, I make house calls. If you ever in there, you bring pizza. <laughs> my eyes are crossing and I'm nodded off twice. Don't want to wake up with scars on my face. Yeah. Our chip shipping is pretty good. I sent a package for 18. My, my, any Canada has been 17 to 26 so far. Depends on the way the wind is going, I guess. Uh, does that mean you're going to bed, Annie? It's looking like it. it cost me 38 to ship a small box to Australia. Damn! It cost me roughly the same as uh, Canada to send to Wales. I think, I can't remember. One, there's a, a way to look on your phone to find out the furthest location from your location. <laughs> Billy, yeah, how it's was this? Australia. You know, it actually cost me, it cost me 12 bucks to send something to Australia. It's actually it, it's, hilarious. It sucks. Oh, that's right, because they're a part of the, you know, Kenny, the British Commonwealth. Right, that's why it was so cheap. I, uh, yeah, you know, uh, America just stayed part of <clears throat> Britain. Who was it? Nancy and somebody else turned me on to pirate shit. I, I, you, I tried, uh, I, I created a pirate ship account and I, I couldn't ship with it. Why? It wouldn't accept, it wouldn't accept any of my payment methods. Oh, that's weird. It was weird. So I found someone else that was just as cheap, and I used them. I'm trying to think of the one I'm thinking of. Uh, I don't. Is it ship uh, station or? Uh, hold on, I got it bookie marked. Uh, let Good me see Chris. again. Good night again, Chris. There was uh, one I saw you. before. Tell the corpse we said hello. There was a ship. Yeah. There was a there was a shipping site I saw. I can't remember what it was. Basically, it was uh, return return empty runs through truck. <laughs> I can't remember the name of the site though. Oh crap! Like, because truckers were coming back anyway, it was just a matter of paying. Like, oh, genie, yeah. 
Jeez, and stuff. Zinni and Nuns be turned oh, on to Ghost Shippo. Go Shippo. You think somebody would do Shippo? <laughs> it is. It's Go Shippo. That's who I use. <clears throat> Shippers are us. I don't know why my sciatic has been acting up so bad this week. Pisses me off. Yeah, I, I yeah, Jenny and Nancy told me about it. Uh, well, at least y'all said y'all you. <laughs> Jeannie, I will give you sole credit if you would like it. Yeah, I sent stuff to Jeannie. I think it was like twenty-three dollars. Good night, everyone. It's Mishi. It's been a long day. Good night, Mishi Lucis. Not Mish. But you had a mo uh, mother daughter day. How did it go? Yeah, I'm gonna bug you. Keep it online now. Oh, Mishi, you should want to tell your day with your daughter. Tell us how your mother daughter day went. I'll tell you what we got wearing. What's your favorite color? Because you know it's going to take you an hour to say hello to everybody tomorrow on your show. <laughs> That's yeah. why she's trying to get sleep now. <laughs> got to work get energy drinks and stuff when she wakes up. It was expensive, <laughs> but it was very nice. I'm really That's looking forward to finishing this segment advice I've been working on. I'm looking forward to starting one. Not. Robin said, I've got my video done, so I'm pretty proud of myself. You go, Carl. Good. Good. What? You finished editing that thing? I thought you were going to do it. <laughs> <laughs> There's no crochet pop ups tonight. What's up with that? Gary, I double checked our chip Australia was thirty eight, but I also checked with USPS directly. And it would have been almost double. Damn. Miss Red is live according to Robin. I finally got to meet her the other night. And Kelly. Red's a hoot. Double? Like double trouble? Unbelievable. <laughs> That's what my dad called me, my brother. <laughs> oh, damn, I'm getting sleepy. I'm so myself. surprised. I know. Jerry said uses. I'm not sure unless he's correcting something he said earlier. Much of it. Hardship for out of country seems way over still. USPS to Canada is triple through pirate. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. Just stick, send it through a, put it in an Amazon box and say return to okay. shipper. Carrier <laughs> Just get a drone, cheap ass. You're a pretty yeah, like, like, have you ever seriously thought about that? That, like, doing some like uh, insufficient funds, return to sender, and just stick it back in the mail, like, with no, no, no stamps on it or anything, or you know, a couple stamps just to make it look like it got sent to you. No postmarks, just say return to sender. Just that way, come back to me, but don't leave your address on it. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Return to sender. Thank you, John. I'm a thing girl. No such number. <laughs> no yeah. such zone. I got one. Thank you very much, Cliff. Got that one going oh, too. Uh, well, you were pissed about the other one. I was trying to change it. <laughs> oh, no, <it's> 
Better than a felter, I guess. I think that's the word I'm thinking of. With, with friends like Cliff, who needs enemas? Yep. <laughs> oh, that's bad. <laughs> you never heard that one before? Congratulations, Billy. You got the Canadian. <laughs> well, no, no. I, I, I've heard it before, but saying it about you oh. saying it is so bad. <laughs> 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 it's damn near a compliment. <laughs> Check us in the bushes. I cannot see what that metal emoji is to save my life. Can y'all? Uh, Put them no. between them two trees, Mike. I, I can't. I, I can't make it out. Uh, please, Jeannie's please, going please, CPC. Night, Jeannie. Night, Jeannie. Love you. Wait. Hold my, <laughs> my magnifier up on my phone and see if I can see it. It's a house. That's what she says. Oh, is that? Is that a sheep or a cow? She, she says it's house. a house. It's not a house. Oh, you call that a house? This is a house. It's not a house. Hello, Hello Ben. Like oh, you know what it is? It, it's oh, a okay, house okay. With a, with a driveway or something. Uh, yeah. I know what the fuck I tapped in, y'all. I need sidewalk or something. <laughs> <laughs> Good night, Cliff. I love you too. Aw, y'all saw that. She wasn't afraid to say it publicly. What? <laughs> I dare her. It's a how. <laughs> how? H O U E. How? How do you make a how? Well, you should how make, you make a, a house, how? house, a house, and a house. She got four houses. You go now. You you taking all the house? <clears throat> you been here for an hour. You go home now. Yeah, it's you all you home. Home. It's not all hour. you for life. Canada Post has shipped from your home now. Well, that leaves me. Wow. Out. What's funny yeah, is I use pirate ship, but I still go grubbing. to the post office. Is that super grubber? Yeah, I uh. I go to the post office to drop them off because I don't want to have to, them to have to wait till the mail runs out here, which is usually late in the day. I gotta look down, bitch. Every once in a while. I'm gonna have nightmares of opening rings. I already opened that one. Where's all my rings? <laughs> John, was it you earlier that said that uh, <laughs> that art was at a fashion show instead of rap show? Or Some, it, well, I didn't say it was at a fashion show. Somebody did. I was Somebody her, did. maybe. And I said, <laughs> what did I say? Art is known for his fashion. Just don't come looking at my headliner size, okay? Yeah, yeah, but I can't what's go that? Hey, Claire, what's up? Are you kidding me? That's awesome. I made a reference to the song. You know, Georgie. I need to finish this yarn shelf loading so I can get some Minecraft. Yeah, that was a... It's almost as if you took the other ones with you, uh, Jerry. You just had to replace them when you got the... Uh, My brother and I wanted those shelves, but we didn't have nowhere to put them. It's going to be epic. Yeah, three or four of them. Craig says there was a guy selling his home and he made his own sign hose for sale. Oh Minecraft, Jerry? I haven't seen that in a while. Don's going to let you play computer games? Oh. You must have been a good boy. It's on now. <laughs> <laughs> I got two big ones more spots than the four I had. Wow. Love you, Jerry. Did you end up selling those or did you have to abandon them? And that's going to break my heart if you had to abandon them. Selling what? Uh, some big ass shells. Tell me. Yeah, Tell like Tell me. <laughs> making a hell of a deal on them too, but we just didn't have the room. We're so desperate to get rid of them, they just dropped them on bottom. Isn't there space for them in there? None that really work. Oh, it's for sale. 
<laughs> he said he chuckled every time he drove. I took a couple months off time to start over on Minecraft. Did you miss? It means they can't survive in this climate. So, oh. Well, it's all fish and wildlife. Nothing to deal with it. In the meantime, though, we're gonna need to find a nice dark place for these guys. Now, Jerry, you build a giant scroll saw house. Minecraft. Yeah. He sold them for 50 bucks each. They cost 150 each. God. We got more teeth than a piranha. I'll bite you. It sucks when you don't have the luxury of time and. Man. You had to let so Money. much go that you probably. <clears throat> uh, no. It's not a good cause. <clears throat> he should have called me about a couple of things I'd have given him fair money for. What's, what's a call X or Cal X? I don't know what that is. Oh, are those? I'm assuming you're talking about the shelves. You can't take them apart, or? Yeah. They were nice shelves too. Decided Chris Neal in his back. Apparently the corpse got moved to him. Or uh, well, well, back. Chris? What had happened? Were they not dead after all? Or Back again? What are you talking about back, Chris? Jeez. <laughs> Your time to turn? He's back. Back again. Look who's back. Look who's back. Back in the saddle. Look there. A back. <sighs> he just keeps trying to tease his friend taking care of it. Road trip tomorrow. That's a good friend. Road trip to where? Oh, that was Chris, not Jerry. Never mind. <laughs> I'll, I'll be here right in a minute. Oh, all right then. I have faith in you. I will or I won't. You know, it, it, it's all relative. It's a true friend when they help you with a body. I've heard something similar to that. Lexington in May. Uh, that don't sound like a fun road trip. <coughs> we have a road trip coming up in June that don't sound like much of a fun road trip either. If I can stay up long enough tonight, I can get Jekka's and friends in the mail, too. There is no way we're going through our brand new floor. says it's kind of nice, though. Went from the Hoarder Palace to a, a much fair down life. Taking care of it. Sucks. Yeah, I feel you. Do you remember Border Palace to a young dungeon? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> I can make my own house now. Sorry. Larry Contreras said a friend of mine is falling on hard times and he's selling off everything in his shop, and I don't have any room or money to help him out. Greg says the guy from our motorcycle club moved. From here to Newfoundland, said it cost a dollar a pound to ship his stuff there. Good googly moogly. From where? To where? Uh, From wherever Greg is. is. I'm guessing where Greg is. Wherever Greg is to Newfoundland. Yeah. Newfoundland. Okay, Newfoundland. Nova Scotty. Newfoundland. Is that what she said last night? Not up to it. Oh, shit. <laughs> that was hilarious. Yeah, Jerry that said Charles the Clip took like five or six photos and did not make much of a dent. He did have a lot of stuff. And I found out that audio auto harp is missing some pieces. So I need to return it, Jerry. Little, little joke, little joke. Yeah. Come and pick it up. <laughs> you know, some people would ditch if they were hung with a new rope. My dad used to say that. Yep. No, I was just joshing back then. I still think it's a neat little toy. <laughs> it's a little stiff around the collar here. <laughs> you guys should come inside and take a look at the pictures on the hotel website. It's amazing. Chris Nealon said you're getting here next year in Ottawa. Yippee! You see oh, yeah, Jerry said I'll... Oh, you can see Robin. You can see Robin. I'll pay you, you the nothing you paid. Yeah. 
Okay. Now, Jerry, it should be double or nothing for my trouble. Is that Robin? Chris is going to come up and see you next year. I still think it's a neat little something to have. And depending on when it is, oh, you know what? If uh, if it happens to be in May, <laughs> around the 15th and the 20th, I'll be out there as well. What? No Jerry way. said he'll pay, pay you the nothing that you paid. Yeah. <clears throat> I asked him to double it. Did you know what? Nothing. Nothing from nothing is nothing. Yeah. We. <laughs> the only time I've heard that is uh, Eddie Murphy doing it as part of his. Team. It's an actual song, isn't it? It's a song. Nothing. He was, he was singing a song. I just don't happen to know. Nothing. Chris, it, it's not out of your hands. You determine when they're going to get married. Tell them they're going to have a May wedding. <laughs> may or may not get married. Uh, okay, me. And Jerry says, "So, John, how's it feel? I bought stuff from everyone else on the panel." <laughs> that's all, awesome. Jerry. Jerry, that that's great though because I'm pretty much the only one that's ever gotten a gift in the mail from you without anybody telling me about it. No. Huh? Yeah. He's gotten he's gotten happy mail. I've never gotten that. Not that I'm asking. <clears throat> I got happy mail from Jerry. Yeah, he bought something from me. You didn't get rid of that, did you? Well, Jerry has ordered something from me, but not for himself. Yeah, yeah. The usual. But it was he, he, he bought a segment of race from me. <clears throat> I, I had used a lot. I was, I was using the magnifiers. Uh, the first, well, the, the first day I showed them, I used them, and then I was using them for crocheting afterwards. Yeah, they come in handy. Look at that. It's all ready to ship. <laughs> oh. They said, nope, kept all the stuff from you and Doug. Cool. Chris, I have a billy bowl. Cool, Art. Just now. Yeah, Chris. Chris, I'm just saying, if it happens to be in May, around mid mid to end of May, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be out. Well, I'll be in Colberg, but it's only like a three hour drive from Ottawa, so it's not that bad. Billy, maybe someday I'll be able to buy something from you for my mama. No. <laughs> Greg said, "What can I interest you in, Jerry?" <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <coughs> That's what funny do you right got? <laughs> okay, I've finished opening another color of ring, so I shall smoke again. Gary smokes. Smoke. Yeah, three hours from Colt. From Colt. Well, see, well, technically from Kingston, so because uh, the grandkids are in Kingston, so Kingston to Ottawa is like you know two and a half hours. I do that in my sleep. <laughs> <laughs> That's not recommended, though. <laughs> they frown upon that. What? Oh, no, it, 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 it's a toll highway. There's no vehicles on it. So, oh, okay. Well, that's different. Go ahead. <laughs> nap away. Nap away. <laughs> yeah. No, nobody, are, but... nobody, nobody drives the toll highways. I don't know why. There's like no traffic on. They're so fast to drive on. One time I accidentally ended up on one because they had changed the city so much since the last time I'd been there. Like, oh, uh, I'm screwed. Well, when you get a rental car, it just, it just gets charged the license plate and you just pay and you're done. And I think it's like $3 for every time you go on it. Huh. My my wife let one go, and they started saying you're gonna have a lot of trouble when you go to renew your license. Chris says he has a Billy Bowl. I forgot about that, Chris. I don't even remember which one you got. Chris says I can drive up to 15 hours without stopping to pee. I can go 18. I can go across the three. Well, because that's how long it takes for the fuel to run on my truck. <laughs> Oh yeah, one of my spin ones. I'm usually drinking while I'm well drinking soda <coughs> while I'm driving, so I can't go that long. Hi, Dad. Oh yeah, Jerry bought a platter too. I think at this point we're rubbing it in on John. Yeah, I just wanted to check and see if it was okay. You're what? You're rubbing one out? <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
What did you say? Jerk off. No, I said uh, at this point it's like we're rubbing it in to John. <laughs> what did you say? Did you say jerk off? <laughs> yeah, he did. I did because of the whatever somebody said the other day. Yeah, Steve Nealon said it. That was hilarious. Steve Nealon. Yeah. He got you good on that one. He couldn't even think of nothing to say back. Yep. <laughs> Jerk off. <laughs> Makes me think of that scene in Liar Liar. <coughs> no old man asking for money. I'm too cheap. Blah blah blah. Jerk off. <laughs> I didn't even realize I said it. That's what's funny. <laughs> oh, I kill me something. Steve said, "Who me?" Reminds me that. Reminds me that Dennis Leary song. I'm mean, an asshole. Holy, 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 holy. Oh, I, I never was a fan of Dennis Leary. Mm-hmm. Probably because he's Funny too song. amped up the whole damn time he's talking. Yeah. And the dogs are barking at something. They can have it. That was I weird, though. Way. <laughs> it was like you're shouting. <laughs> wah, wah, wah. Yeah. Right. I found my critter. There'll not be no skunk because you sleeping outside tonight if it is. Chris said, talk his cheek, Cliff. Hello. I'm looking for the possums. I forgot what I said. See, I'm losing my fucking shit. No, I'm not kidding. <laughs> Greg said, I let one go all the time. <laughs> Half the time people react, I forgot what I said. Like, who fired that shot? I fired it. <laughs> <laughs> who farted in the winter circle? Have you heard that one? <laughs> it's a horse called a hoof. It's hearted. <laughs> it's like those, those fucking kids' books there. Eh? Yeah. So he's got big blue balls. <laughs> Mary Fish stinks. <laughs> <laughs> I hadn't heard that one. Those are hilarious books. I can't believe the guy that wrote. He reads them with a straight face too. The guy that wrote that wrote them. Oh my god. <clears throat> oh, you were quoting a guy that was writing books. I thought you were being personal there for a minute. No, 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 no. He he actually writes <laughs> like, like, the. They're children's books, but they're innocent. But it's just the, the innuendos on them, though, right? Yeah. They're intended um, to be. And uh, uh, the, the lady that reads them, uh, the Red Squirrel or something, I think her name is. Um, There's a much prettier one that reads them, too. Both. Wait, okay, you guys can be together. Actually, look, 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 Google bad children's books. Or adult children's books, probably. Katie, let's go. But there's a very pretty blonde that, that uh, reads them to us, too. And then she'll comment on Tyrone one. finds corn in his shit. There you go. <laughs> wow. Seriously. Jerry said, okay, back to the yarn wall. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Chris said, speaking of farting. There you go. There you go. Charlotte's webcam. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. Did you touch my shit? <laughs> There's a June bug in here the size of a wolf. <laughs> there you go. See? <coughs> Tyrone finds corn in his shit. Wow. Yeah, these are like bad children's books. Just wondering what Dude, shit they're going to chop your book. Oh. I'm going to get some more. And one about the beaver. And uh, one this weekend. Jasper, the remember. Hardly Boys. The Hardly Boys. Mystery of the Urinal Turd. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh my god. <laughs> we're so much. We're so much. Sucks, sucks to be a fatty like you. <laughs> oh my god. Let us see. Yeah. 
<laughs> Sucks to be He's a bad. A, a, fatty, a, fatty, a fatty like you. <laughs> a, a big little golden book about turd. How's this guy do? Oh, Billy skips balls. <laughs> The foot book, Dr. Zeus's wacky book of fetishes. Oh my god. Can you still breathe, Grandma? Buy this book before it's banned. Bad little show. <laughs> Larry Contreras said, under the grandstand by Seymour Butts, yellow stream by IP Freely. <laughs> here's, one, here's one for Russ. The, sa the sailor and his love for semen. Ben said, you guys are a bad influence, but I like it. <laughs> there you go. Frosty the bitch slapping snowman. <laughs> <laughs> Rusty wow. Bed Springs by IP Knightley. Yes, Greg, Greg Come on, you know Holding the mattress by Mr. Completely. <laughs> <laughs> I would say so. Or she's very shallow. Oh, was it good? Uh, was it good for you, sheep? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Lord. <laughs> hey, John, you need to buy all these and have another live you start. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to Naughty <laughs> Night Time. Polly Paint. <laughs> Polly Paint. <laughs> <laughs> Lord. Oh, God. Um, I thought we were talking about innuendos. They're just going right through it. No way, <laughs> Don't Mr. worry. It only seems kinky the first time. <laughs> oh, God. Trail to the Outhouse by Did He Make It, Larry Contreras said. Illustrated by Betty Don't. Hump me, dump me, <laughs> the, me, dump me the story of a badass egg. Unreal. <laughs> oh, there you go. I'm so fucking but, immature and I love it. By the time you read this, I'll be dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're going to hell. Who's driving? Arst is shaking his head. <laughs> Nancy, okay. Nancy Drew mystery stories. Eats bad beans, farts so profusely that her house burns down, and then she sees some guy masturbating in the bushes. <clears throat> hey, Larry, did you read the one Antlers in the Treetop by Who Goose uh, to this? Little Brown Mountains by Squirt and Leave It. <laughs> oh, damn. So much for innuendo, they're just going straight for it. When daddy goes postal. <laughs> There's another one for us. Oh, Lord. Uh, Don, yeah, the, like, just Google Google bet, wor worst children's books. I think the ones that are funnier are the innuendo ones where they could be taken bad. Let's go to Father. And we are agreed on this. There will be no Jasper Trail. Why? Why? I can't even count the reasons, Georgie. But most Georgie. of all, if you weren't honest with us about this trip and what it was really all about, as it stands now, neither of the three agents can be allowed to stay on the street. But that's not fair. You weren't fair. You lied to your dad. You lied to not me. fair. You're not fair. That's all damn thing's not fair. You can't handle the truth. Isn't it? <laughs> good segue, good segue. Get, guess what, kid? Life's not fair. Yeah. No, Paco. It'd be a great school swap project. Man, I should, I should just fucking print all those off. There's a lot of detail in some of those, though. You hear that? Not yet. It was a silent one. What? What is it? Listen. Listen. Where's it coming from? What is it? What's going on? It, the acting sounds impeccable on that show. America, American actors with Canadian writers. I'm telling you. <laughs> the best. I'm 
frightened. Come on, the the show's called Heartland. It's about a freaking horse ranch. Yeah. In Canada, where there's no horse ranches. Like, seriously. There's, there's literally no horse ranches around there. Really? Yeah. There's a lot of, well, there's a a lot of cattle a ranches in oil. Hey, guys. Hi. Oh, so 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 High River. High River is actually known for its uh, abattoir. What's it called? Abattoir. Oh, the abattoir. Abattoir. You know what an abattoir is, right, Billy? No. Yeah, it's, it's, it goes in place of so your it's a slaughterhouse. It's a what? No slaughterhouse. Oh. So 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 High High River's major major economic influx is, is is from cargill cargill foods and the slaughterhouse so uh, like like right next door to the slaughterhouse the car cargill slaughterhouse is the auction house wow so all the uh, all the cattle farmers bring all their cattle in they get auctioned off and then they go right next door get slaughtered and packed up for meat and go to everywhere yeah that's High River's claim to fame. Slaughterhouse. Not horse ranching. Slaughterhouse. <laughs> or abattoir. I don't, well, um, I guess that would make it a good a show or something. Their view and audience don't know that. Look, <laughs> a horse. Kill it. No matter how well you do it, it's a separation thing. Oh, and there's uh, uh, actually some some rich oil guy down there actually has his own railroad in his yard, life size railroad in his yard. Wow! He's got like two engines. He's got like two engines and four or five, four or five uh, cars, uh, a couple More of cars. And, it's a big uh, freaking yard. It is a huge <laughs> yard. I, I think it's like how'd, eighty acres. How'd you like to mow that? No, thank you. Let's just make it look like it's Once a week. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he, he actually gives like little tours to his little railway yard, his rail yard that he has there. For free. Me, me and Carrie stopped in there one day. I asked him, so how'd you get into this? He goes, ah, I like the, I like, I like the, like playing with the railway cars when I was a kid. And when I had enough money, I decided to buy a real one. So oh, that's kind of cool. How? In their feces and the urine, there's something called protozoa. Must be nice. I heard feces and urine and protozoa. And rusty, where you uh -huh. get a. I did too. <laughs> a lot closer than we did. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we're going to start that shit again. <laughs> well, you're here for that. <laughs> yeah, motherfucker. Yeah. yeah. Dad, yes. Had Charles Rowland. Well, I'm kind of in the middle of something too, right? Huh? Oh, for you. Okay, just start chat. Da 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 Yeah, what's up with the chat? Do 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 do. I don't think. Ding dong ding. Dead chat. The bitch is dead. Another flawed ring. I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it all the way through this bracelet tonight, but I guess we'll find out. Focus on getting rusty done. That has exactly worked out so well so far ahead of time. I brought him here because he had a weak immune system. You poisoned my horse. Damn, there's fighting words. Stability, Caleb. I'm still waiting to hear back on some other tests. Three legged dog yeah, walked in the bar, so I'm looking for the man who shot my car. Yeah. Horse walked in the bar. Bartender says, "Why the long? Why the long face?" Yeah, I was uh, born this way, motherfucker. Two whales walking into a bar. Oh my god, who started that before? Was that 
I'm doing my best. I don't remember. Who started that? Two whales. Two whales walk into a bar. Pat H. It was Pat H, wasn't it? I don't know. I know a fish ran into a wall and said, damn. <laughs> You've never heard that one? <laughs> yeah, I, I, I forgot. <laughs> Welcome back, Chris. Well, what, uh, Things are yeah. quiet, Art. What's going on? Get a you done? Hey, Chris. Well, sure yeah. Can. Probably talking to his girlfriends. Let's finish, too, then. What did I tell you? What about Jane any, and Mary? Don't have any. Jane yes, and Mary. So we, yes, sir. It helps in the end on either. I was looking something up. He's buying some of them bad children books. <laughs> mm. Will you read to us, Art? Will you read to us? Probably there were these guys online. I think they didn't but they needed the adult coloring books. They won't talk. I don't mean adult coloring them. I'm, I'm talking. Never mind. Oh yeah, I see some really bad adult coloring <laughs> books. They're like really bad. I'm selling all my rings to get markers. This show is not rated for children. <laughs> This show for children is not rated. I remember Charlie told me he heard a comedian. He said, uh, uh, con something like context matters or getting into too much detail matters. Because he said, for example, I could say, man, I love kids. But if you get specific and say, man, I love 12 year olds, then it looks bad. Well, I've said, I've said that before too, right? Like, like about about my grand my grandkids. You know, I, I love I love my grandkids. It, uh, I love my grandkids, which is great to say, but you don't say, "I, I like little boys." It just doesn't sound right. <laughs> and a, and a a woman can walk up and pinch a baby's ass, but catch a man doing it. Get away from him, you sick bastard! Well, nobody puts baby in a corner. Let's see, grab her ass. Oh, I see what you did there. I don't think so. It sounds like some RCMPs. Or else they didn't none in the police. What'd you say? Real? Shat bit. I said royal. Royal, okay. Royal. <laughs> royal. I had it go in my head too, man. I'm telling you, it's creepy how much we think of like, <coughs> my Canadian hunk of bacon. Or my hunk of Canadian bacon. They're mastered, though. Um. Wow, the cat just died right down. What's up with that? We're probably looking up those children's books I mentioned. Yeah, it did. Everybody, I, I, I think everybody must be stunned. They were all here for Jeannie, Connie, and uh, uh, Jerry. <laughs> And then Chris at YTF, he came back and saw they weren't here, so he said, well, fuck this. Once they're talking about little kids. That's, I'm, I got a ring for you. Yeah. That's good. That they're listening intently to the show and pissed that we're talking over it. I felt like I got free TV. I am so sorry. I took Rusty for a ride. I let him drink from the pig. I had no idea. You know what I just wondered, John? Do you think that would cause a copyright strike? What? I wonder if there would be a copyright strike. Or from a TV show in the background. Probably. Nah, uh, not really. You're not hearing all of it. This is true. <coughs> this segment of your show 
was copyright struck. <clears throat> You've been struck. See, I'm a, unlike Charles, I never, I never get put up for review. I just get told the next day. <laughs> That's why I wondered if somebody was like reporting them every show or something. I mean, I know there was people putting thumbs down. It's probably some some bit. There must be one hell of an amazing live going on right now, or a giveaway, or. Can I get that freaking song on my head? I gotta, I gotta watch freaking uh, that royal? The clown. The clown image. No, yeah, well, yeah, but he 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 he, he sings the song royal. Um, the clown, hey, uh, the sad, sad clown. Uh, his pity party. Something, so, yeah, something pity so, party. Uh, something pity party. Yeah. He Beth sings said, it's, it's, he, he, Sorry. He does an awesome rendition of it, though. Beth says, I don't go on a panel with the TV on because you can get a copyright right? Fucking oops. Rewind. <laughs> well. Can you guys hear me? Can you hear me? Hey, young lady. Three more rings and I can yeah, smoke again. I, yeah. Puddles. I, I tried. Yeah, puddles. Puddles pity party. Uh, uh, Puddles pity party. Uh, he, 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 he sings a strong, a strong chandelier. He actually does a really good version of it. Yeah, I I did, I did, said like Puddles. I, Puddles party did, party, which makes more sense. <coughs> <but. laughs> I, I did like his rendition of chandelier. See when 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 he did uh, uh, the hell song was that? He he, he sang the song to the to tune of. Uh, 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 he, he did a mashup. It was uh, uh, what, what? What's that song? Uh, Folsom Prison Blues. Um, Puddles Pity Party. Oh, what the fuck? It's Potty Party. No, Puddles Pity Party. <laughs> no, I just Puddles Pity Party. Uh, <laughs> some Prison Blues. Okay. He sings. I'm off the. Oh, he, 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 he sings Pinball Wizard. To the tune of Folsom Prison, Prison Blues. Oh wow! <laughs> and he does not miss a beat, and it sounds so cool. It's, it's funny that his name is funny enough. His name, his name's Chris Weir. I try not to go on panels when she's watching TV, but John made me come in. <laughs> yeah, and he never left. Larry said, my damn spell check said potty. Hey, Adele's talking now. Chris and Larry talking. What? It's crazy. Greg said, the times have changed greatly. Back in go as they had rump day, where the guys would take a beer company sticker, place them on girls' butts forcefully. It was sponsored by the student council. <laughs> <laughs> rump day. Okay, now I'm a schmookin'. Robin said, "Billy, who? I'll be back." Billy Burke, Billy Burke, Billy Burke, Billy Burke. I think you're alone now. I think we're alone now. Doesn't seem to be anyone around. I think we're My favorite song now. from her was uh Beating of a Heart is the only what, sound. Or something like boom, this. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom. Oh, boom. Oh, boom. Hi, boy, boy. Baby, yeah, yeah. Oh, I love that song, man. I'm telling you, I listened to that multiple times a night every day before I went to bed. I'll probably listen to it now since you mentioned it. Not now, but tonight. Every day at four, I'm under bed. At four, I mentioned. Bell checker. Beer button chicken. <laughs> Beer button. I had forgotten. I forgot how much I liked that song until I run the back across it. <coughs> yeah, they were one hit wonder, couldn't even get a record deal, and then it came back and went number one. That's crazy. They weren't even a band anymore. <laughs> Uh, 
I used to listen to I I used to listen to uh, how was it? I think it was Pig Pig Radio or something. It, it, it was an app on the phone way back, and uh, it, it used to be a uh, it used to be one station called One Hit Wonders, and they have like the best freaking songs on there. Yeah. Don't you mean Ham Radio? <laughs> That was after ham radio. Oh, you said big radio. It was a it was a pun. Never mind. I'm trying to remember the name. Of, I, I can't remember the name of the station. It, it, it was an actual app. And then they got rid of it. That's like, I used to listen to, like, like I said, I used to listen to one hit wonders. I'm like, what? These are one hit wonders? How? how was... Yeah. It, apparently, a one hit wonder basically means if you didn't have two hit songs on the top forty, you're a one hit wonder. And that's the way that doesn't at. make sense because somebody actually called White Lion a one-hit Yeah. I never understood why people liked Great White. They, they, done for me. they opened for White Snake when I saw them. White Lion opened for Sin. It's almost tomorrow. Well, it's like a, uh, a concert I would love to go to was Lamp and Dawson. It was uh, Skid Row and somebody else. Uh, Buck Cherry, I think it was. I think I would have gone for Skid Row. I didn't I like Buck I, Cherry. I, I would have. <laughs> but... I, I, I would have. I would have paid for backstage tickets to meet Sebastian Bach and be like, hey, oh, Sebastian, yeah. fucking sign this Gilmore Girls fucking yeah, thing that, up for me. That range on that guy. <laughs> I remember well, you doing know, 18 in life. Back when I was 18 in life. <clears throat> I played that song like eight times in a row on a jukebox because I was like, and I just got broken up with my girlfriend. I was, oh, I, was at, I was at the pool hall and I played it over and over and over. It was all like, John, stop it, man. She <laughs> left me. She left me. I don't know what to do. Oh, if I ever, somebody ever wanted to get their cry on, I, I, could, I could work that. Like some of the uh, Your audio just dropped right off. That's because of stupid Bluetooth disconnected. In my back? Oh, my. There's one, uh, yep. it's a it's a country song, but uh, it's called So Much Like My Dad. And there's a line where he said, she says, she's going to leave me, mama. And then the next line he says, uh, I can't live without her, mama. That was right after my wife left. That was still in my house. And I couldn't stop listening to it, and I couldn't stop bawling my eyes out. <laughs> but I love the song. But the, the gist of the song is, if I'm so much like my dad, what does you always do to make him stay? Cool, Larry. I don't think I ever saw Great White. I did the opening for White Snake, and I wasn't a fan. Rock Me, I sort of like. That was it. Once bitten, and twice thing, shy. Got overplayed on him. Yeah, I was say, did, did, didn't they say once bitten, twice shy? Yeah, and MTV played the shit out of it. I miss MTV used to play songs. I wouldn't like any of today's shit. I sound just like an old man. You know, band I miss. Freaking Pursuit of Happiness. POH. Doesn't sound they're, familiar. They're, they're Canadian. They're from Toronto. Oh, there's a problem. <laughs> See, man, they, man, I they, miss they, Deep Purple. They, they, played, they, they played on bass before they actually had their first cassette out. Huh. <laughs> they they played at our high school before they had their first cassette out. Yeah. But yeah, Deep Purple was before my time. I consider them more classic. I mean, in my terms. I like Deep Purple. I just never listened to them really. Yeah, I was a big Deep Purple fan long before Smoke on the Water. That's the only song I even know they sing. I mean, that I know it's them anyway. Highway Star, Space Trucking. Nope. Space Trucking Through the Universe? What? 
God. Among others. Never heard of them either. <laughs> Just my, wo my woman from Tokyo. Hopefully I'll hear the dog scratch on the door this time, but I know I'm not going to stand there. Good night, Robin. <sighs> okay. At least I'll be starting this one. I think I might get finished tonight. Okay. This will be black and gray surrounding red. More that gray than black, though, remember? Which you may see. Actually, they'll be they'll be equal. They'll just be the red's going to be the main color. But I wrote it down when she said it. Beth said, "Soldier of Fortune." Chris Charlton said, "You're still on." <laughs> You're still here, Chris. I think she comes back. He came back. Oh, Chris. Oh. Excuse me. Oh. Good Lord. <laughs> Kentucky woman says about by Neil Diamond. Sweet Caroline. I was waiting for y'all to do that part. You know, you, you do know that person not actually in the song, right? Sure, yeah. I, I, I never listened to that post. It's been too long since I've heard it. <laughs> Neil Diamond had an interview. He's like, I don't know why people sing that. It's not part of the song. <laughs> I'm just starting to understand that. Lord. I don't remember that one, Beth. <clears throat> I do remember. Have you guys seen Tom Kidd's video for Tree Falling? I worked with a couple of people who do handrails. And the burn. They filmed the video at. <clears throat> and I breathe. Breathe all in. That's the only time. Why are you ruining it for me? <laughs> tree falling. I told you, man. Oh, it's tree falling. How dare you sing the correct lyrics? Sweet <laughs> Caroline on stopping. See, I sing Sweet Carrier Mine. Better interdesting. I hate it when my ear itches under headphones. You know, I got that damn song stuck in my head. I'll tell you, we got a winner going tonight. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, John, one inch is the the most slack I've ever been requested to add to a bracelet. <laughs> oh, that's cool, a bracelet, Barry. okay. <laughs> <clears throat> so, 
I've done black and red and gray before, but I think it's going to be a little different. It's going to be cool. What song is Woody? I heard a song that we're on Billy's side. Probably theme music. What was that? He said he I heard, heard a song. song. Is that a line? There's a city with Jack and Diane. Two American kids oh. growing up in the heartland. Never was a big. I've heard now that he's a whiny little bitch. Check it with the I mean, uh, Somebody uh, in a. There was a TikTok yeah, video where he was, getting, he was telling a long story, and then somebody in the audience yelled, Just sing. And then he, he said, Fuck you, and all that stuff. Yeah, and then he started this, well, Fuck you. He said something like, Well, one more time. Outburst like that, and I'm leaving. And then he got past it, started to sing Jack and Diane, and then he decided, okay, show's over. But I've heard he's he's a pretty one, a little bit. I never was a fan of him. Blood on the scarecrow, smoke on the cloud. Three bracelets in one day is not a bad day's work. Praise me. Yeah, but is it as good as Arts Day? Huh? Yeah. Ah, uh-huh. no, probably not quite. <laughs> probably not as lucrative either. Lucrative. Lucratic. The Lucratic system. <laughs> Did you smoke your supper? <laughs> oh, have what he's having. Larry L.C. said, I see that he was getting political and it passed the fan, pissed the fans off. I don't doubt that one bit. We didn't pay to hear you talk, asshole. Well, apparently you did. Although I have heard, and I'm not, don't quote me on this, but he, I'm going to anyway. Something about it's, on, it's on video. I think I I'm heard quote, something I'm, I'm about. I'm going to quote Cliff on this. The poster said something about story time and singing, if I remember correctly. So then, they were the assholes. I should say both sides could do some work. Greg said Eddie Money was drunk and had a piss on stage at an outdoor concert. And MB, is that, would that be Manitoba? No, that would not be. Uh, my, my Myrtle Beach? Manitoba. Yeah, Manitoba. Yeah, there's some people that just need to stop. There's a well, guy, like when, uh, Freddy, what was that? What the fuck was his name? Anyway, well, wait, he was lip syncing the whole show. He was barely moving. Shania Twain. Freaking lip sync at the Grey Cop that I went to, and I was so freaking choked. Cause you, she's up on the video, up on the video screen too, and you can see her lip syncing, and she's missing the words. And then the music stopped, and she, the, the like, she sort of kept on singing, and there was nothing coming through her mic. You know, she was lip syncing. It was just it pissed everybody off. But sing your fucking song. Well, a lot of the time, the uh, either the 
the what the management <laughs> or the, the venue will for the, for the quality. We couldn't get the mics working, sir. That's why they got sound checks. Yeah. Because I, I have seen examples where a band or a singer has been told you're going to lip sync. And they'll, on purpose, like there was one of the mamas and papas or something like that. And she took a bite of a banana in the middle of a, of a line of the song to prove, look, they told me to lip sync. I just saw that one the other day. Larry says, I no longer watch TV. Mo yeah, movies or TV because of Hollywood politics. Susan Sarandon is always in your face with shit. Just a little old. I could live with or without her in any damn movie. Why, TFP Chris? I watch you. older movies, 80s, where politically correct did not exist. No shit. There's so much shit we used to watch that would never go now. Without you. Eddie Murphy always up wouldn't go down. It cannot hide away. It cannot hide away. I can't do it. With or without you. Larry just watches YouTube anymore. Yeah, I, I just realized I really don't watch anything where there's acting in it. And that's <laughs> Adele spoke. It was to somebody in the chat, but it's speaking. Or writing. Adele, my bell. Ring my bell. I love that Ring song, too. <laughs> Holy crap. Look at the time, people. What the Holy hell? crap. You keep me awake I this late. I sold myself. To the devil. In my mouth. I don't know why I'm spending so much time on this project. <laughs> see what happens when I don't talk. No, like, like, like seriously, you see what happens when I don't talk on my lives, right? Like four hours, like it's freaking this thing's done, and this is how it's done. Like, <laughs> and you're complaining, <laughs> and you're complaining. No, I'm just saying, no, 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 I, I'm just saying. So, it, 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 it's nice when people just read the chat, and there's no fighting or anything else. So, is your shop all nice? Glad I could be here. No, no, Chris, no, Chris, I'm gonna say 25 percent. Yeah, he got a he got a commission, so he set the hell with a clean shop. I'm going yeah, for the money. Right. So I worked on the uh, the drawing this afternoon, sent her the pictures. She says, yeah, that's awesome. I asked her the size. And she messaged me. She goes, How, let's talk pricing now. So we did that. Went, ah, I should have charged her more. <laughs> <laughs> if she'd have stayed much longer, she might have bought from me and Billy. <laughs> Adele says, what? Flirting? What are you talking about flirting? Who's flirting, Adele? And the chat just moved real fast. Uh, that's because you talk with your hands, John. That's what Greg said. <laughs> uh, I'm not Italian. I'm not Italian. You do not Chris know. Says, you do not know what I'm talking about. You do not know. TV shows had moral stories in the 70s. You had to figure it out ahead of, t ahead of its time. In the 80s, we got, see, Timmy, this is why you don't smoke crack in the bathtub. <laughs> and also, the more you know. <laughs> <laughs> I got it from you. I got it from watching you, okay? Well, Beth, I hear you calling. I can't come home right now. I mean, uh, uh, you stay so late and get up and go to work the all down and then do it all over again. Uh, I've always said that too, Larry. Just a few that, hours and I'll be right home to you. I think I hear them calling. <laughs> oh, Beth, what can I do? No, uh, did you hear, hear Larry's comment? God damn it. 
How is it you stay up late and then get up and go to work all day and do it all over again? Uh, I do for the fans. I do it for the people. <laughs> the people are what I do it for. The oh, people are what uh, inspire me. The people are what keep me going. And Adele thought it sounded like I said she was flirting. I said you were, you were talking, and then I meant at least I said speaking, and then I changed it to writing. Oh, sound like I said I was flirting. My bad. This keyboard is on the hard <laughs> stuff. Hard to one finger tap with a cat on your lap. The memory only goes back to last week. LOL. That was some good. Well, I, keep, I, I, I can keep singing your best song for you if you want. You say it feels so empty that our house just ain't a home. I'm always somewhere else and you're always there alone. Just a few more Some... hours, I'll be right home to you. Somewhere there's Think a bucket I long hair in the Oh, fast, <laughs> what can I do? A tune carrying a bucket looking for you, John. <laughs> Oh, there's a hole in the bucket, dear Liza. dear Liza. There's a hole in the bucket, dear Liza, my dear. Oh, shit, that my new laugh. Nice shark art, said Larry. I mean, Greg. See that that is nice. Nice shark art. You only work so you can afford to scroll all night. Like you have the cricket nice. L channeling Mr. T. John. It sounded like Jessica said nice art. I didn't know Jessica was still with us. What you been doing? You only Rocketing? wait, wait. Larry says you only work so you can afford to scroll all night. No, no. So, Larry, <laughs> let me get something straight here. I scroll <laughs> for the fans. Now, the thing is, like, because be because my show was more educational than and, and fun than anything else. Um, everything in my shop is already paid for by all my work that I do, like, by, by from scrolling. So, it, everything in my shop is paid for from scroll work or woodwork, right? So therefore, it, everything I do is just it's profit. It's just that's what I do for fun. That's why it's a hobby. Because honestly, if, if I was to do this like production work, like I know I, I'm looking at the crochet stuff, I'm like, oh, I'm gonna make freaking eight thousand granny squares for a blanket. I'm like, you know, that's production work. That would be just gonna drive me nuts. Now I know that. Thank you, you Adele. Jessica said I've been hooking. Chris said I paid the fool that don't buy my scroll saw puzzle. <laughs> Hello, Tanya. Oh, Tanya, what have you been? Uh, where you been? No, I haven't. Where? I've seen you so long. I've been. forgot what the team. Uh, I've been following. <laughs> that said, to fix it. Dude, I, I've you? been. Uh, I've been following. I've been following you, uh, all your posts and stuff. You're, are you feeling better now? <laughs> Thank you, Justin. It's been like it's been like, it's been like all, almost three months. Like in hospital visits and shit and bullcrap and stuff. Bullcrap. It's bull crap. Bull stuffing. You're still extreme. You're still extremely sick. Uh, uh, fucking believable. Hey, Jack, I'm about to show you China. Well, I mean, I'm so well, worried. You better about get it. better. You better yeah. heal up and find out what the fuck is going on with you. It's an eight to eight. If I went John. <laughs> John, would you like to see? Shiner's bracelet, what it's going to look like. Oh, her bracelet, yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, I look inside, Jekka. Uh, Wait, just give me a sec, I'll put you on. Just give me a sec, I'll put you on picture. Okay. Well, oh, that's not her away, bracelet, right? that's the baby bracelet. I said the bracelet what, it's going, what it's going to look like. It is our nipple clamps. Oh, shit, I wasn't supposed to tell anybody. Gray, black, and red. It's a brace, a Looks brace good. Green. Thank you. I'm, I like this color team. I've done black, red, and gray, but not in this layout. And Miss Coco Puff said, I went to a hospital by ambulance the other day. Damn. And the doctor, who never seen me before, said, what is it about this place you like so much it keeps bringing you back? <laughs> I'm hoping so, Jessica. I you know, you know, Tammy. Wrong. You know, Tammy. Is, is it good that you put two dots in there? Because I would have said it like I went to the hospital with Amos the other day, and Doctor Who <laughs> never saw me. <laughs> he uses magic wand. He uses magic screwdriver on me. Oh shit! What Thank magic you. screwdriver? They use this tool on it. 
So I should be in hospital, but it's a crap shoot, she said. Oh, yeah, oh Lord, something done backdrafted. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I just, you know, I'm, I feel for you because you're in the hospital so much now. <clears throat> I do remember uh, her being in the chat before, and I learned her name, and we, we talked. Yeah, I, you, still call, you, you still call her TW, though. No, it's so because cool. they forgot her name. It's been a quite a while. So Tammy on 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 YouTube and on Facebook, it's uh, Ladybug uh, Ladybug Gnomes. There's another Ladybug. Yeah, but this is Ladybug Gnome. Yeah, but I'll screw it up. Finally remembered one Ladybug. <laughs> We got Taffy and Tanya. <laughs> oh, see, that's, that's going to screw you up too because uh, Taffy and Tammy, they're both ladybugs. And they both replaced the F with the M. Oh my God, this is so similar. Hi, Tammy. Ladybug, ladybug, fly away yeah. home. Hey, I remember. Uh, Talking to her at least the once, so I didn't forget her altogether. But she's on the show yeah. at least once, at least twice. Um, oh yeah, at least I remember talking to you. I have slept since then, as my brother would say. Better than the bug lady is my Chris. <laughs> the bug lady. Yeah, that's a bug lady. She's all covered in bugs. She caught a bug, that's why she's in the lady hospital. Bird. You see what I did there? You see what I did there? I've never once in my life said ladybird. Well, well I guess I just lady did. Bird. I just did. <laughs> so embarrassed. What was the name of one of the president's dogs? Oh, no. <laughs> Wrong. It was yeah, yeah. Lady Bird no, Johnson. No, no, that was his wife, right? I know. <laughs> And then uh, Lady Bird's the dog on uh, King of the Hill. Oh, I never watched it enough to remember the dog's name. And Tammy would like to know what you got going on there, John. Are you doing? I'll let uh, him. Never mind. My bad. I'm cutting Super Grover. Just give me a sec. I'll show you the concept behind it. And Super Grover didn't even do nothing to him. He's a cutter. So one of the uh, crocheters, Crafty Annie. She, uh, I was cleaning my shop today, and I showed a, a broken Supergrover that I never completed. And she's like, oh, I love Supergrover. I'm like, oh, that's okay, cool. She's like, oh, how much for one? I'm like, well, let me do the drawing, so I'll show you the full concept of it. And she liked it, and she wanted it, so I'm doing it for her son. But let me just finish with one cut here and I'll show you the concept behind it. See, and this is just part of the whole that I tell everybody on my show. Everything for sale, just let me know. Someday I might commission something from you. I guess it'll depend on pricing and such. Or my success. To be I'm not able to. For you, though. <laughs> well, I'm not, I feel, I feel you. Okay, so, so, so what I got going here is I got a Super Grover logo ripping out of his shirt. All right. Just monster hands ripping through his shirt with the Super Grover logo. And then I'm going to have, this will be all stained and colored, and then I'm going to have Super, Super Grover on the front of it. I'll cut out <laughs> my front. That's gonna be cool. Overlaid in it. Look, why wouldn't yeah. why wouldn't you do my logo you anyway? Because you, you got like you got one three D printed already, so. Okay. And your brother did it already. Ha 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 Yeah. Well, he, your brother he started did it. a wood. I, one, I, I, and, so so. Yeah, it, exactly. So, so therefore, I got to compete with your brother, right? Oh. Doing a wooden one, and that's the last thing I want to do is I would do I your brother you. on a wood project. So your brother turned into John. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> no, I, uh, it's a mindset thing, and since I'm not paying him for it, I get it. 
They ain't got a ton left, but there's some painting involved too. Well, yeah, but but the thing is, is w w would you want a Johnified friggin' chair logo to put on your seat, like or I, a Johnified? I, I, would you like a Johnified logo to put on your BRB there? When you go, <laughs> that's gonna that, that, that Charles gonna have to look at all the time and be like, I could have done that. I could have three D printed that. Right? <laughs> could have. I could have been a right? contender. <laughs> I, I might would get a Deadpool or something from you. I, hell, I don't know. You get well. See, I thought you wanted a Deadpool from Jekka. Oh, I changed it to Peanut when I saw her Peanut doll again. I forgot that she had that. What you mean a scroll off of Charles? No, Chris, it wouldn't be a scroll off. Maybe because of, because the thing is, he, Charles or uh, uh, Chris got a nice three D three D printed one. And the thing is, is if I do one out of wood, that looks better than his three D printed one. Can you just gonna lose it? <laughs> uh, no, I, I want to be able to support you too, homie. Someday. I got a what? I got a bracelet. Damn it. Damn it, Jim. I'm not a doctor. <laughs> and it came full circle. It got mentioned twice in one day. Twice the same show. Oh, I, I couldn't remember if that was this show or the earlier one. That was this one because I was over putting the pattern on. I might, I might need to take a potty break. Well, I'm almost done. I'm almost done here, so. Damn it. You're going to make me go to bed at almost normal time? Then no, again, you I can stay up. You can stay up. I'm not stopping you. Oh, I know. I'm almost done here, too. Uh, I probably will finish working what I'm working on, get labels and stuff, did. Packing them up. Oh, one of these... Dogs just smell like a corpse fart. Holy shit. That would be funnier to Chris. Because <laughs> he's probably been around a few. Why can I never remember where he lives? Maine. Vermont. North Carolina. Vermont. We traveled pretty far for that time I met you, Billy. Yep, he's coming back this year. All right, cool. I wish the hell we could make it easier. Hell, I got to get 40, 50 bucks just to come weed whack my brother's yard. My truck don't get the best mileage in the world. Took half a tank to go to Jerry's and back. <laughs> It's a 1995 that will happen. Okay, back to work. Won't stop him. Oh, Tammy, you haven't been around for a while. Um, I don't know if you if I sent you a friend request for this one, but uh, if you would like, follow me. Stalk him. Or uh, sub to me on my other channel. Like what other channel? What other channel? What are you talking about, John? Adele is leaving us. We love you, Adele. Good night. Bye, Adele. Good, Good night, Adele. Adele. Probably because you didn't play her well, sign up. Yeah, I, was with I played it twice already. Twice in four hours, man. <laughs> More than I used to. Too much is not enough. <laughs> hey, there's another song to get in y'all's heads. Too much is not enough. Check up on Ten again. Can't get enough. No, 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 I can't get enough. Too much is not enough. I'm a singer. What you saying, John? Said Tammy. In a rock and roll band. Uh, no, just give me one sec here. Uh, yeah. Don't leave me running. Uh, 
Share. Why can't I share? I can't share my page yet. It was a little bit funny, no? I like well, copying and pasting. I'm getting so shares. distracted now. Oh, right. Any old damn business, white boy? Okay, I have I have a new page. I have a new Facebook page right there. And I have a new YouTube page right here. Billy, what you doing? There's my new YouTube page right there. Billy, what what? I was curious what you're doing. And it's called It's called Hooks, Whips, and Chains. <laughs> it is my uh, my uh, my new crocheting channel. There's like nothing on it yet. Like I did one video so far, and it was on last Wednesday, and uh, I had to do it on my channel because I had to pre preload it for the 24-hour wait time for it. So yeah, so I'm a crocheter now. Get my yarn. <laughs> he's kind of a yarn slut. Hey, yeah. he's, he's one of them hookers. Oh, you just seem very what you're in, very into what you're doing, Billy. Is uh, what I was curious. Oh well, I was watching an Australian cooking show. Oh. The audience applauded when the chef made a meringue. I was kind of surprised because well, Australians usually boomerang. Oh my god, that is so bad. <laughs> I just caught that, I, and it's only because of John Shrat's funny. <laughs> you, if you had gone boop, meringue, that okay? That's yeah, I'm. Good. I'm <laughs> yeah, Tammy, I'm a I'm a crotch keeper now. He's a crotch and uh, put yarn haul on it. <laughs> that, shit, that was good. <clears throat> What was you actually doing? That was good. Well, yeah, I, I don't know if I can remember that one. Oh shit! I'm gonna tell my mom that one. See, I got a bag of I got a bag I got a bag of yarn the other day. That I haven't even opened it yet, so I don't even know what's in it. Is there a problem? What are you actually doing, Billy? <laughs> Just sitting here. <laughs> she said, "Love you." All right, Aww. we're gonna we're gonna call the show off. Call it what you want, but you ain't going nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Jeff yeah, is the general bad. jealous of all right. of those hookers and bets. Did he say he's a crotch hitter? Yeah. Isn't that how you pronounce it? A crotch eater? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's French. Crotch hitter. There you go. <laughs> hey, sir, we on the paddle. All right, are you still there? Can you hear us? Yeah, I'm here. <sighs> Does anybody yeah. want to? I, 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 I didn't move it back yet. Does anybody want to hang while I finish my bracelet? I got a strain you ought to. I'm just asking before you leave me on because. Stone. Looking for gemstone and jump ring. Wait, Crystal. Crystal's, Crystal's asking you a question. How do you like a little bucket for gemstone in jump ring? Are you asking if I want a bucket of gemstones or jump rings? I'm not sure. No, I think she's asking. I'm not sure either. I don't know. Well, I'll, I'll just do this in case anybody wants to hang out. Um, one moment. <laughs> he was a prime minister. <laughs> That's Christian. <laughs> Let me get back over there. If anybody'd like to hang, well, there's me room. I'm oh, gonna hey, be working on a so no how. Yeah. <clears throat> gonna hang out, like look at that. All right, so uh, thanks for being on the panel. Thanks for being in the chat supporting us and taking care of us and having fun with us. And uh, we'll catch you all uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow for some more daily scroll. I'll do some. I'll do some more cleaning up in my shop first, so people get their fifty percent done. 
And then, oh, I gotta find more. Oh, I gotta go get some crayons. Okay, I'll get some crayons and I'll do some clean up. I'll do some more clean up in my shop. I gotta find a spot for this yarn. Like, I want a wall, like, right there. I want a wall right there. Like, put on my crochet I'm stuff. Ready. Maybe yeah, why don't you like? Oh, uh, <clears throat> saying, why, 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 why you just do a live? Uh, because I'm not ready. <laughs> well, you are. You, you, you're you're doing the exact same thing now that you're going to be doing your live. I get that, but I don't want it to be my first show. I want a little bit more big to do for this. Okay, but but the thing is, you can just delete it or make it private afterwards. You can go back and change other stuff on it. I'll keep it under advice, but it's not looking good. <laughs> you, can just, you, you can just do it like a, a, a pop-up test live, that's all. That'll work. All right, everybody. Take care, have fun, and we'll see you all later. Uh, Mom, my night, everybody. Not everybody. Not everybody. Not everybody. Not everybody.